Hello. I hope you're having a <laughs> good evening. I accidentally hit the wrong scene. I'm a little sleepy today, so mistakes are probably a little bit more common than normal. Oh. Be gone. So how is everyone else doing tonight? <laughs> yeah. It's just a sleepy sort of day, I guess. Work was a bit rough, but nothing too bad. You're almost done with the five dollar poker chips, so that's good. Um What's after what's after five? I don't I don't know how poker chip sets work. I'll be around for a couple hours doing the first in person Oh wow. I'm looking at churches with my dad. Oh, the 10 is next. Okay. Well, good luck with the churches. But the the D D sounds great, if nothing else. <laughs> but if churches are like a, a big deal to you and your dad, then also, you know, I hope that goes really well too. But Yeah. Churches haven't been a big deal for me in a while, so that's generally why my reaction is, oh, good luck. Oh, you want to look at the architecture. Oh, okay. No, that, that that's perfectly fair. I mean, old churches have, like, really glorious structure and um, stained glass and all that stuff. It's all super pretty. So yeah, no, I get that completely. Your dad writes a blog about medieval church architecture. Oh, that's really cool. That's really cool. The Atomic Rainbow? Oh. Normally lack church and therapy in the public. That's okay. That's cool. So you can actually get like a glimpse. Most churches aren't locked, but those that are open up for the day. Oh no, okay, that makes sense. Yeah, that I could see why you'd have to make a day of it then. And get pictures and stuff while they're open. Oh yeah, yeah. I think I remember you telling me about the story of the poker chips. Depends on each. Yeah, I, I don't remember how to say the first word. I know what it is, but I don't remember how to say it. Um, church warden, vicar's policy. Dad has strong opinions about how they should be open, but not everyone agrees. Yeah, no, I get, I get that. Um, uh, I spent diocese. Okay. Okay. That's how I thought. But I also, I, I was like, it's either diocese or like diocese. So <laughs> I didn't want to. <laughs> I spent most of my teenage and young adulthood um, entrenched in Mormonism so I completely 
understand the concept of open to the public, not open to the public. Pretty architecture. Like, many of the LDS temples are amazingly pretty. Um, like the one in Tokyo is super gorgeous. Um, but yeah, they're not open to the public. So. They are very rarely open to the public. Probably more diocese and British English, but I'm not going to say anything's invalid. And in the UK, of course, it's a rather different situation. This is Church of England, largely, and Church of England is relatively harmless. That's fair. That's fair. It's... Yeah. Is state church on paper? Okay, yeah. Um, what's effectively who um, the pilgrims ran away from, right? We have a state religion, so nobody cares about it. <laughs> I mean, I want it to be more extreme. Yeah. Yeah. By nature, it's always had to be kind of accepting. Oh. Oh, because it's... It's meant to command loyalty. Yeah, yeah, it's meant to be everyone's religion, instead of just a few. <laughs> Not the good dirt biking and Mountain Dew extreme. <laughs> I mean... Oh, God. Can you imagine extreme dirt biking for Jesus? <laughs> There are slash were sort of unofficial factions within it, like High Church, Low Church, and others. Oh, I'm pretty sure evangelicals in this country can do anything. Surfer churches? Eh. I want to be surprised, and yet at the same time... High Church are the ones who wanted to be more Catholic, while Low Church wanted to be more Protestant. So both kinds of architecture around. Yeah. I was kind of wondering if it was a split like that, because I know that uh, Catholicism has a lot of pageantry and ritualism and just... Generally, if I see an amazingly pretty church, I assume it's Catholic. An old Catholic church. Definitely. High, high amounts of tradition. Um, whereas Protestant is much more... Relaxed. Like, at least it kind of is. My dad went to a university college that was technically a Catholic one in its origins, even if that had no actual meaning by the time he was there. <laughs> and the rival college was the Protestant one in the same way. <laughs> Relax or austere, depending on the type, that's true. They could be, you know, more relaxed or... Um, yeah. <laughs> the yearly prank was that they broke into the chapel of the other college and burned a load of incense. <laughs> I mean, as far as pranks go, that's kind of innocent. Yeah. <laughs> oh my goodness. Just sort of forcefully baptizing the space and in incense. 
That's true. I mean, that's a good point. I mean, either way, I would have been, like, exceptionally uncomfortable <laughs> the next day if I were in either of those chapels. <laughs> I'm kind of sense sensitive. So. <laughs> I think I've only been to. <laughs> the sticks to hide them. <laughs> Oh, man. Eventually, you figure out, Ah, oh, it's that incense. Ah. You have weed-smelling incense for the joke of it. <laughs> I enjoy the concept of incense. I just can't actually partake. <laughs> yeah, no, I... that makes sense. Even if you... If, even if that's not what you ever actually use it for or whatever. It's still a funny thing to have. Yeah. No, I, I completely get you, Eva. Um... The cat girl I live with um, completely cannot handle uh, artificial scents of anything. And actually some natural scents too. A roommate that loves sage oil. Oof. If it were legal. Yeah. So yeah, I think we've managed to find a few things that they uh, can tolerate because I do like nice smelling things sometimes, but like I don't want to kill them. So <laughs> um, right now the main thing we found that works is lush. Oh god, yeah. I've got a vanilla diffuser in the hallway because the neighbor kept complaining about imaginary bad smells no one else could smell. Did they have a dead mouse in their walls, perhaps? Oh god, yeah. Glade scented things. Uh, most air fresheners. I think the worst one I ever encountered was I was in a hospital. And... They have like this either person activated or something like room thing in the bathroom at the hospital. I'm like, guys, you're a hospital. I know you want things to smell nice, but shouldn't you be more cognizant of these things? I was eight, I was taking to get an endoscope to figure out why I was getting so many nosebleeds. <laughs> That's, uh... I assume it was because of sensitivities to scents and stuff, or allergies. Yeah, I mean, cleaners aren't terrible. They usually have a sort of blech scent to them, but yeah, they just smell like cleaners. They don't smell like someone's imagined scent of fruit or flowers. Particular type of horror to have your head locked in a chair, got a cord stuck up your nose like total recall, with the only light coming from the doctor's monitor whose first words was, oh my god. The most sensitive nasal membranes you'd ever seen. Oh jeez. <sighs> That's no good. 
15th century stained glass peeping birds. That sounds gorgeous. I love stained glass. It's just so... It's interesting. Uh, <laughs> I said no as goblins. Billy told me about them, but I thought he was lying. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Churches here, of course, are a thing more than just merely religion. Yeah. They're old. They're like historical landmarks at this point. Oh yeah, and where they kept the records, that's true too. 900 year old ones, oh my gosh, that's so far back. Yeah, if you want to do genealogy, generally you have to end up going into churches uh, one way or another. Yeah. I mean, we have... We have old stuff, but... Yeah, going back that far, you're almost... You're pretty much predating the Americas. Almost. And we wouldn't have had the setup to build Nothing but some of the most oldest buildings would be that old. I'm sure you have even older ones. <clears throat> because we are a relatively young country. It's kind of like thinking about it. Oh, yeah. Oh, man. I mean, that must be really cool to see. But yeah, you're right. Time wise, that, that would be about the same. God. That would be neat. It's a shame. It's a shame it's not, but. to that old joke. <laughs> ah, yeah. 100 years is a long time. Europeans think 100 miles is a long drive. Yeah. 100 miles. Sheesh. I mean, it's like... Uh... Like almost a thousand inch from Michigan to here, so yeah. More than a thousand? <laughs> yeah, it's fine. You have a grumpy nose, it's fine. Yes. Ah. Okay. Okay. Good. 
There we go. Hello. Got two down here. Got that. Got that. Got that. Uh, I can see that. There, got everything on one. Oh. I could do this now. Let's not blow up the chunk, alright? Ah, my goodness. It was very quiet in here. I guess let's feed my fish before I go. Whatever. Back in this shop. I have so many, so many spots. Okay, this is the one I need to do. Because I don't want things to explode. Um, how should I take down for this? I don't play with the bug. For the Turian mission, I might still be dealing with Turian, so it seems logical to bring Garrus. I'm thinking Garrus and Javak. I think that's who I brought last time, but it makes some amount of sense for this one. So yeah, I think we'll go with that. Yeah, sure. What do we got going on here? My weapons. I have a new assault weapon. I have a new assault weapon. I have a new assault weapon. I have a new What is this? This is Jack. Okay. Predator Rhythm, Predator. Yeah, that makes sense. Alright. Better fire rate, lower damage, lower accuracy. Yeah, it's not. Would you like giving the team the appropriate ratio of our Yeah, no, that makes sense. And I got him with the... Yeah, he's kitted out. Predator or... Yeah, that makes sense. Let's get him. Ah, I got the tempest. Gotcha. Huh, 
could carry a shuriken as well. It's really nice. So heavy. Everything in here is super heavy. Honestly, I'm pretty happy with those, so I'll keep with those weapons. I have two points. Darius has three points. I can do that. Javik has four. Yeah. <laughs> mm. I'll save that for. I'll save levels for the next. Save points for next time I level. There we go. Normandy Shuttle, this is Lieutenant Victus with the 9th Platoon. Do you copy? We hear you, 9th Platoon. We're approaching the bomb site, Commander. Getting bounced around pretty bad. This is as close as we get, Lieutenant. Look for somewhere to set your platoon down. Copy that. Talk to me about this Cerberus bomb. It's not Cerberus, Commander. It's... Turian. What do you mean, Turian? It was planted centuries ago, after the Krogan rebellions. The bomb was a safeguard against another galactic war. Brutal, <laughs> but it makes a certain kind of sense. Put the Krogan down hard if they tried anything. You won't earn trust with tactics like that. But right now we focus on disarming that bomb. Yes, but Cerberus found it. Detonation means all-out war between my people and the Krogan. Right. Where is it? Those buildings ahead. Cerberus brought equipment to dig it up. The 9th Platoon will cover your flight, Commander. With all this activity, the Krogan have to know something's up. Then we can't fail, Commander. Copy that, Lieutenant. Well, this is messy as hell. Oh, right into the thick of it, huh? Well, damn. Damn! That was a good choice, giving him the particle beam energy weapon. Oh, gosh. Whoo! The horrors of war, gentlemen. Ow. Okay, so he's dead. Whoops. That's a centurion. Is that a bad guy? No, that's Garrus. Okay. Can't see shit. What do you think I'm doing? Far forward. Oh well. We need to keep moving. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, it's so much quieter all of a sudden. Okay. We need to keep moving. Yeah, I heard you the first time. Am I going in? Am I going in? Once we reach the bomb, I'll need to reprogram the trigger mechanism. Copy that. Hello. Uh, how did I miss that? Where was that? 
What the hell was that? Was it just leaning up against the wall there or dangling? Whatever. At least I caught it. Shepard has breached the perimeter. Keep hitting shift to run instead of space. Pretty sure one of the other games I'm playing recently does that. Well, goodbye. Whoops. Steady, steady. Beautiful, steady. Oh, it's quiet. All right. Commander, an exit on the left. An exit on the left. All right. I will check for it in a second. There have been equipment pieces scattered around, and I don't really want to miss those. I'm assuming I can purchase them, but free stuff is always better. That's the generator. Ooh. Thank you. Shield generator. Console. Hell yeah, I give money. Money is. We defeat the Krogan and then plant a bomb on their planet. Pretty extreme, but those were desperate times. A cunning strategy. Control your enemies without them knowing. I mean. When the Prothean agrees that you did something right, perhaps you did not do something right. <laughs> Good boys. I shouldn't really be calling them boys. They're they're men. Oh, hello, gentlemen. Really? Okay. really think I'm containable. Sheesh. Contain me. <laughs> uh, do I just go down here? I don't like the sound of that. Boing. I'm sorry, you think you can leave? You don't get to leave. Detonation protocol. Oh, that's definitely not good. Definitely not good. Oh. Ugh, so much viscera. Uh, I 
hopefully I wasn't too slow and it was just merely scripted. Well, there's a better vantage point up that ramp, Shepard. Agreed. Let's go. Hmm, fires. Found remote. Whoa. Beautiful. A planet killer, hidden under the ruins. It must have been far enough underground to stay hidden. Cerberus had to dig it out. I hope Victus knows what he's doing. We won't get a second chance. We gotta move, Shepard. Commander, we're entering the bomb site. Moving towards the control station. Roger that. We're on our way. Yeah, this... This, uh... This area is fucked. The Krogan. On top of the bomb. Will be back with everything they've got. It was a mistake to allow us to get this far. <laughs> Javik, ain't that the truth? It's not like they had much of a choice, truth be told. Pistol stunner? Oh, hello. What's this? Is this nothing? Ah. Definitely got some newer machinery in amongst all of this. I can tase. Ah! That'll be fun. Oh. I, don't, I hope those weren't good guys, because he's dead. Usually you aren't allowed to shoot good guys. Garbage. Med kit. Turret control schematics. schematics for automated turrets. No good now, but they might be useful later. Oh, yeah. I don't know what I'm supposed to do with that. That is not something I can access. That's a shield generator. Oh. Reload's gone. Okay. Okay. Ugh. Stop hitting shift to run. set up a firewall around the trigger mechanism to slow us down. I need to create a bypass. That'll take time. But like you said, no trigger, no explosion. Are you sure you can disarm the trigger? Yes, it's old tech. I know what to do. Find me a few minutes, Commander. We'll make sure you have the time you need, Lieutenant. Understood. Yeah. Starting bypass. And thank you for making sure I get this chance. <laughs> Just make it right, soldier. Oh no! Look out! Commander! Focus on the bomb. We'll handle Cerberus. Nobody gets past us. Clear? Understood. I missed. Right? Okay. Get a little bit further in. Ah. you was 
with a stray bullet. the centurion god oh hello get out of here oh take that thing down now hmm yeah, where'd it go? Did I drop it? Yeah, I mean... Centurions took a lot of casualties, Joker. The Primarch's son included. Understood, Commander. Joker out. He never hesitated. Whatever he was before, he'll be remembered for Yeah, this. that's true. What will the Turians think about this, Garrus? Hard to say. Sacrifice and more is expected. He did us proud, but... We're a hard bunch to please. Living your life for the cause. Society first, platoon first. It's all just expected. He did what he had to do when it counted. Yes. Yes, he did.
Good work right? on Tachunka, Commander. Stopping that bomb prevented the war between the Turians and the Krogan. We can't afford that kind of division right now. Joker said the Krogan are recovering the bomb? They moved in. Won't allow Turians to send in recovery crews to help. Understandable. The situation is fragile at the moment. With Rex and the Primarch aboard the Normandy, you've got a situation brewing. We don't have a solid alliance between those two yet. Keep the peace, Commander. That's an order. Yes, sir. Heck it out. I'm doing Could my best. Risk another galactic war with the Krogan. The Genophage wasn't enough? You had to plant a bomb on my planet? The decision was made hundreds of years ago. So much has changed. Not enough to tell us about the bomb, coward. Hey. We can't let the past rip us apart. Working together, we have a chance. That's true, Primark, yeah. You had a bomb on Tachunka. And Rex, in the Turian's place, you would have done the same damn thing. That's very sure. true. It's over. His own son died today making this right. Please, Commander. It's all right. Yes, fine. Shepard, you made your point. We have stronger enemies to face. I don't think much of anyone else would have been able to talk to Rex like that. <clears throat> I understand your reservations before, Commander. But I hope you now understand the secrecy. Secrets get people killed. You've learned that the hard way. Yes. The hardest lesson I'm ever to learn, Commander. My son. He died with the respect of his men. I wanted to thank you for that. His sacrifice will be recorded in the histories of the Ninth Platoon. Something any father would be proud of. Yes, sir. Want to send him up to the bar on deck three? God. Yeah, I think he could use a drink. Again, Commander, thank you for ensuring my son died with honor. It's all a Turian father can hope for. But this is war. The time for mourning is later. Is there something you need? Okay, uh, okay. Despite everything, Primarch, I'm sorry for your loss. Thank you, Commander. And I know I'm not the first to lose their son to this war. Needless to say, I'm committed to stopping the Reapers. That's all. Of course, Commander. Mm. I always go the wrong way first out of this place. Hmm. Wouldn't that be nice? I heard what Victor's did. He was a brave man. I don't think I could... Uh, there I go again. I was going to say that I could never do that. But? But I was wrong. Being here, watching you, you've shown me what it means to serve in the Alliance. You're a good officer, Trainer. Glad you finally realize it. Thanks. It's not that I'm volunteering for bomb jump duty. 
I'd suggest sending someone who has armor first, if possible. Mm. Yeah. I swear to God. If she dies saving my ass, I'm gonna be grumpy. Ah, hello, fish. You are wonderful creatures. Okay. this mm, I think so Kettlefish, can you ban that? Um The Krogan team mission May well be the first of a few. Okay. Nah, I think it's. Hopefully this is what I'm supposed to be doing. Um, it's again, it's again the um, issue of, oh, it's listed as this in the missions, but it's fucking different. It's uh, in the game itself. Entry. The Reaper weapon. Before the, the introduction of the M560 Hydra, missile mm -hmm. launchers either fo yeah, that. Okay. 
Little bit more. Seventy C to negative sixty C. Wow. Okay, so who should I take versus right? Girl team? Yeah, I was thinking Liara. I was thinking Liara and Evie. Which I don't I want to use Meh. Yeah. Sometimes I'll punch things. I'm probably going to change it back after this mission, but... Uh, she's using the Predator. Um, I got... Tempest. A little heavier, but a little bit more accurate. You have eight points. Alright. Have we learned anything, Shepard? Our backup's waiting for us at the drop point. Arlac Company. Krogan Commandos. That's correct. They are an accomplished unit. Made famous for their decisive action liberating a colony from Batarian pirates. Good to hear. Other than that, there's been no word from a team of Krogan scouts since they went through the Rachni Relay. There are many reasons that communication with the scouts could be disrupted. We don't know much, but no Rachni activity has been reported. Still, it's troubling there are rumors at all. It's been years since you released the last Rachni queen on the condition she disappeared forever. Her race was all but extinct. She would not risk annihilation by starting a war. 
Just be ready for anything. Yeah, shuttle just arrived. You better get moving, Team Two. See you. Ah, uh, hello. Grunt. Shepherd. <laughs> Shepherd. <laughs> what are you doing here? I could ask you the same question. Didn't those idiots lock you up? They did. Put me in lockdown to keep the Batarians off me. Didn't want problems with the Council while they prepared for war. But the situation changed. Yeah, they got bigger problems, all right. That's why I'm out here running Arlac Company. They're tough, think they're invincible. Reckless, but effective. Sounds familiar, Grunt. How'd you go from being new and unproven to your own command? Yeah, <laughs> wasn't easy. When Rex put Arlac Company together, he needed a leader who represented the future of our species. Thanks to you, I completed my rite of passage on Tachanka and became part of Clan Erdnot. I was an equal. And being the strongest, I was chosen to lead this honored company. I bet some didn't like a tank bread Krogan being in charge. I collected a few scars earning my place here. These Krogan respect me. He has a little bit of mouth texture now, too. You were a pain in the ass, Grunt. But if your Krogan are half the soldier you are, we might make it out of here. Hey, <laughs> glad you're here to crack some heads, Shepard. Hard to believe this might be Rachni. Seems crazy. The Rachni. Chance to face the old enemy? <laughs> Impossible to resist. We don't know if the Rachni had anything to do with this. We're here to find the scouts. I didn't see any signs of activity during our approach. Agreed. But this place smells wrong, like a bad wound. Our scans show the tunnels down there lead to a large central point. If we're lucky, it's a nest. A nest might be fortunate. We could end this here. Hehehe. <laughs> <laughs> company, move out! <laughs> Grab what you need, Shepard. Meet me at the scout camp ahead. Sounds good. Take what you need and move out. Yes. Camp. Aw. What do we got? Spare parts. I can have a barrel. Ooh. Yeah, go ahead. Pulled two things for me to take, but hey, two things is two things. done well for himself. Tank bred genetics combined with experience. Yeah. Huh? Hell yeah, give me that. Complains about his room not having a window. I thought it was a shotgun. Nice. <laughs> oh my gosh. Maybe I don't kiss as well. <laughs> oh, that is, yeah. Weapon bench. That's great. <clears throat> It's very quiet here. Are you a little unnerved, Edie? I mean, truthfully, I am as well. Ready, Shepard. We're right behind you.
Well, I'm down here now. Everyone all right? Shepard! You in one piece? Looks like we're all okay. Keep in radio contact. On our way. Okay. I hope there is nothing else up there that I needed, because that's gone now. <laughs> I'm awake now. <sighs> okay. Something up ahead. I see it. What is that? Grunt, got a body of a scout here. Been dead a few days. Yeah, if he has his weapon, grab it. You won't need it anymore. Okay. Oh. Is that webbing? Looks like it. Hmm. This is uncomfortable. <laughs> Not. Not enjoying this. I mean, this is pretty. Bit of an homage to aliens. Stay close. It's easy to get separated. Oh, good. Everybody, be ready. <laughs> Did anyone see that? <laughs> okay. Ah, shit, that was wasted. This this isn't where I go. This 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 is where I uh Note the wire shepherd. Reaper technology. Oh Maybe. good 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 good. Okay, good. Two and one on that one. Oh, yep, there's a spare. So I won't pick that one up yet. Oh, good. Goop. Goop. Huh? Just water? Normal everyday water? Oh, I don't wanna... Okay. Uh...
picture. Amazing. Yeah. It's the rachni or what's left. Another species twisted by the Reapers. No. Grunt, rachni presence confirmed. Modified and very dangerous. Finally, something to kill. Nothing here mine? yet. Lost a Krogan to a sinkhole. Bad way to go. The nest has to be here. The significant amount of Reaper forces indicates we are on the right path. Are these my rachni? I hope these aren't mine back then. Yeah, they do seem to like, uh, manipulating. Other species into disgusting. No question, Reapers have been here. Agreed. Let's find out why. Uh, uh, do not want to be a barrier, Shepard. Copy that. It must open somehow. What is that? It was some kind of lock. <laughs> We're finding another way out of here. Come on! What was that noise, Shepard? Sounded bad. Cave in. We're all right. Good. Didn't want to dig you out. Well, that hurts my feelings, Grunt. Yeah, yeah. Um. Oh, good. Score pause to the left of. Looks to me maybe the way I go. Yeah, so I should go explore the right hand path. Just to be sure. I can hear chittering in my ears and I don't like it. Shepard, I know what happened to the scouts. What'd you find? Died making sure we could make it to the central chamber. Come on. 
got to avoid the laser beams. Okay. Okay. Oh, good. Money. Did that just loop? Did that just loop? Maybe. I don't know, I'm so lost! Yeah, she got that one entirely. I'm pretty proud of her. Looks like a last message. He's asked that it be delivered to an Asari named Araba on the Citadel. Okay, I will do that for you. No worries, friend. that one up so I have a fresh one. Oh, this one's just a hole. <laughs> okay. Another hall, Shepard. Expect trouble. Uh... Clicking. I don't want to go that way. That's gross.
Okay. Disgusting looking hole. Yeah. Okay. We must be getting close, Shepard. Some heavy fighting. Tough bastards. Casualties? It's fine. Krogan fight better angry. <laughs> Look, little dude. Get out of here. Bunch of grenades. The rack knife gave her highly toxic environment for breeding, but this atmosphere is breathable. There's no telling how much the Reapers changed the rack knife. I'm hearing gunfire. 
Oh hey, it's the boy. Damn. Thanks, Shepard. That wasn't webbing stopping us. That was Reaper tech. <clears throat> we ran into it, too. The Rachni have backed off for now, but they can smell our wounds. Any worthy enemy would regroup and finish us. Soon. We're close, Grunt. Those barriers were protecting whatever's down that passage. We'll dig in here. Kill anything that moves. Buy you some time. Good luck. I don't need luck. I have ammo. <laughs> Kroger, uh. Get ready. All right. There we go. More eggs. Take it slow. I mean, it said examine, not go through, but okay. Good thing I did a bunch of small girls. What is that? Oh, God. Grunt, we've located the central chamber. Good. We got your back, Shepard. <clears throat> Okay. We need to find the power node. <laughs> oh god. What? Yes, I know I need to find a power node, but where where? Can't go there. Go there. Ah, there it is. Heavy resistance. This is it, people. There's the thing shooting. Shepherd over here. Yes. Yes. Ah. Uh, 
pointing out the barrier node that I already knew I needed to grab. Come on, we gotta get past these barriers. There must be more power nodes on the other side. Oh. Oh, that way. Where? There's the big boy. Oh, let's get over here. Copy that. The Reapers did this to you? Yes. The sour note of the machines is everywhere. I let you go back on Novaria. You promised not to interfere anymore. The Rachni were supposed to disappear. We remember. We kept our promise. Retreated back through the relay. can't hurt you anymore. Yes, we understand. Can you still feel the Reapers? 
Can they influence you? We hear the machines, but they cannot control us. Remove this last shackle, and we are free. The children return. They will destroy us all. Release us. We're getting movement here. A lot of movement. Copy that, Grud. Are you capable of fighting the Reapers? We hate the machines. We will fight for our unborn children. Really us. She's badly wounded. She needs time to escape. Shepard, we're out of time. We stay here, our that company dies. Is that clear? Listen up. Arlak Company holds the Rachne off while the Queen escapes. We'll buy you some time. Grunt, fall back to our position and lead us out. Damn you, Shepard! I'm leaving my team. On my way! Commander, that's an order. She's too valuable an asset to lose. Save her once. I believe in her. I I believe that they are just susceptible to reapers, and that they don't intend. And also, like. God, Rachni on our side. They were terrifying and unstoppable until the Krogan. Shuttles down that path. I'll hold them off. Get out of here, Shepard. This better not be the last I see at front. My turn. <laughs> <That's> squash. <laughs> Excuse me. Cortez, we're the last ones out. Copy that, Commander. Shuttle is waiting. Oh, he's a little drifty. What? Anybody got something to eat? Ew. <laughs> Ew. Hopefully that's not all him. Hopefully that's Arachni guts. Ah. I'm doing a report on the Arachni situation, Commander. This could have gotten complicated fast. I hope you know what you're doing, cutting a deal with the Arachni Queen. We got burned last time. I'm trusting your instincts, Commander. We can count on her support, Admiral. Excuse so. you. But we cut the Reaper supply of new Rachni troops and picked up some additional Krogan support. I call that a victory. I've got to get back to it, Commander. Watch yourself out there. Hack it out. Shepard, you made it out of there. Sounds like I missed a hell of a fight. Hello. 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 How are you doing? It was What's bloody, up, girl. We could have used you. Too busy talking rather than fighting. Feeling restless. A war going on and I'm stuck keeping the peace. Okay. 
I heard you made some kind of deal with the Ragnai Queen. If they get out of hand again, it's your ass on the line. Understood. I heard Grunt managed to get out of there with a few scratches. You could say no, that. Maybe. We'll get him patched up. Back in the fight. Good to hear. I should get back to it. Keep me posted, Shiver. Ooh, Shivers. Hello, baby. Hello, baby. Got some alien? Rachni workers. Oh, wow. Huh. I mean, that's kind of terrifying, but okay. He didn't save the Rachni Queen in one. They've made a clone to do this. You love that one, though. The war spur will go down as she goes berserk, being properly indoctrinated. Holy shit. I mean, that's cool, but also... Ah! <laughs> Terrifying. Krogan. Grunt. Grunt is his own thing. Nice. Ah, god. Hi, Suki. Do you want to trade spots with the keyboard? Do you want to- no, no, that's not trading spots with the keyboard! Okay, that's behind me. I can tolerate that. It's on my mouse pad. Okay. Uh, 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 wonder? Wonder, 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 wonder. I wonder what I wonder. Tech clubs? Hello? Incoming. Sure. So, Reapers don't have colonies. You can't bomb them, or you're bombing what's left of your own planet. They make their own soldiers out of our civilians. They don't have supply lines. That is a fair point. Hello. Look at that galaxy map. Do you know how many strategy games are built for that interface? You play strategy games? A few. Most are too flashy though. I prefer chess. I have a set made from rose quartz and hematite back home. Ooh. I like the feel of something Classy. Well, now that I know your weakness, we might have to try a game. <laughs> It'd be more fun than playing Edie. Edie doesn't sweat. You sweat playing chess? Depends on how much fun we're having. Are we flirting? Is that flirting? I don't know what to make of that. <laughs> you could have blanks with Trainer just like you could with Kelly. For chess club, yes. Ah, <laughs> uh, uh, that section was stressful. I didn't like that very much. I mean, it was very well executed. I was very tense. My shoulders are extremely stiff now. See if I can find Grunt. That's the only thing I really want to do before I do the next quest on the mission log thing. Oh, that's you too. Perhaps stimulate cell regeneration with a. Could. Ah, but you should test with the. That's worse. <laughs> yeah, no, that makes sense. I, I, I don't want to necessarily encourage it. Um, like, I don't mind flirting and being friendly, but I don't want to actively um, molest my... Yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't want to sleep with the journalist. She's the one you can accidentally sleep with. Where's Garrus? Huh, there must be, like, 
not here. That's fine. Uh, so grunts doesn't seem to be here. Oh, well, he might be. Oh, no. This is his old spot. No, this isn't his old spot. They move around the ship. Oh yeah, Joker! Joker, 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 Joker. My jaw hurts. Let's see how he feels about everything. Anything. Oh, oh yeah, that's right, because Garrus and Liara were, like, hanging out. I thought that was cool, but also weird. Don't worry, Edie. Once the Krogan are gone, we'll get rid of the smell. While this body has olfactory sensors, I do not have positive or negative associations with any specific scent. Oh. Well, lucky you. <laughs> How's Grunt? Our little tank baby's all grown up, huh? Apparently, he'll be on his feet and killing again in no time. Well, you learn from the best, Commander. Every time he incinerates someone with a shotgun and does that little laugh, he'll think of you. Edie says it was Rachni down there? Yeah. I thought they were on our side after you saved the Queen on Novaria. It wasn't her fault. She got captured. She's with us now. Until the next time the Reapers sing a sour yellow note of whatever. Thanks, Joker. How you doing, Edie? Shepard, I had a question about human behavior. Why is it you never have questions about Asari behavior or Turian behavior? I tried asking Liara questions about the Asari bonding process. She said I do not guard the secrets of the Normandy's crew carefully enough for her to entrust me with such private information. The Asari word she used translates as flabbermouth. I think she has become a more private person since becoming the Shadow Broker. Tell me about it. <laughs> I mean, that's hilarious and adorable. I mean, also, the person she thought was her girlfriend and the love of her life just broke up with her for Garrus, so, you know, she's allowed to be a little bit... Commander. Oh, that's back there. Nope. Oh. Hey, Esteban, for your shuttle being so stealthy and all, you sure do get shot at a lot. Well, the UT-47A stealth systems only internalize yeah. heat and high band emissions. So while few sensors can pick us up, our cover is blown as soon as someone looks up. Time for an upgrade. Most scanners and tracking systems don't operate in mid-range frequencies. Sure, maybe we've been shot at, but we haven't been shot down. Yet. Lucky for us, you're almost as good a pilot as you think you are. Well, yeah. There's that, too. There's people all the way down here. What are you guys doing here? I don't remember the full part of what they used for the descriptor, but I think it was more elegant. Everything okay with the shuttle? Boiling shadows, that's right. Just double checking the inertia dampener coils. It can be twitchy in these UT 47s. But don't worry, this bird's been rock solid. I always see you down here working your ass off. Ever take any downtime? I get my sleep, Commander. Flying tired is nearly worse than flying drunk. What about your waking hours? Any RR? &R? I need to keep myself busy. Otherwise, well. Too much time to think. I appreciate your dedication, but I don't want to see you burn out. I know my limits. I wouldn't take a chance with your life. So before this war, you must have done something to relax. Sure. I remember back when the honking was based out of Arcturus and I was just a fighter jock. There was this observation deck overlooking the main flight paths. You could watch every ship taxi in and out. When I was alone, I'd turn off the auditory emulators and just watch them drift by in silence. You know, there are views like that on the Citadel. Next time we're there, you should take some shore leave. Clear your head. I don't know. Maybe. Take some time off on the Citadel, Steve. 
as a favor to me. If you put it that way, how can I say no? You can't. <laughs> he's a sweetie. I like him. I know he's gay and I can't date him. Three technical manuals. <laughs> That's true. That would be a Donnelly thing. Alright. Cargo hold. Hello? Commander, I understand you faced Rechni on your mission. You know about them? In our cycle, we used I mean, them as weapons. You were there. Biological proxies. No, wait, you were. It was before I was born, but every Prothean had heard the stories. When we knew of them, the Rachni spent their lives singing thoughts to each other. But our scientists were more interested in their biology. The Rachni were well suited to harsh conditions. So we bred them for violence, selecting the most cunning and warlike of the queens. Then we unleashed them upon our enemies. For a time, it worked. Until they became too cunning and warlike and turned on us. We put them down before they could develop any further. We thought they had been exterminated. Yet it seems our experiment evolved into this cycle's nemesis. You want to grab that one too, little fish? Kenneth, do you ever think about when we were abducted by... No, Thank I you. don't. Me neither. At least it's not as bad as my poor friend Gumi, who got hit with, I think, like, eight of them during his stream earlier today. I've been going for, what, a couple hours? I've only gotten two. Oh, oh. There's some wood. I'll knock on that. I had to look around for wood because my desk is in there. Can do a story. That's as classified as it gets. I suppose it would cause a panic, but wouldn't the news drive up recruiting? It might also piss off a Krogan with diplomatic immunity. No thanks. Alright. I'm not gonna talk to her, cause... I am... Work... Let's check down the... Let's just try to vault myself over the banister. Oh goodness, excuse me. Ooh, the hiccups. <laughs> oh gosh. I don't think Kirkland have the problems with the diplomatic community. Um, Krogan may not, but other cultures do. <laughs> right? I mean, that is a pretty far fall. And... I think Shepard takes full damage if you fall. No, wait, game doesn't let you fall. I'm, I'm looking for my dang people. Where are my dang people? It wasn't the first time we've faced Ragnai. Oh, hello. You've seen them before? Zero or one hundred. On Ovaria, Saren and his minions were trying to extract information <laughs> from Ragnai Queen. You saw the queen? Hell, we spoke to her. You spoke? I can't imagine that. The things you've done, sir, they're amazing. Well, it didn't seem that way at the time. Mostly, you're just clawing your way out of one mess and into another. Either you're fine or you're dead. Yeah, that sounds about right. Hi, Garrus. How you doing? Regaling. Just one word, Shepard. Grunt. There'll be a lot more dead reapers now. <laughs> Glad you think so. Right. Yeah, it's, it's mostly that the other cultures have a concept of diplomatic immunity and attempt to apply it to the Krogan. And the Krogan sort of don't get it, but... Stop beating yourself up. It was crazy of me to ask you to join the Normandy back then. But I let you down. I let Shepard down. I let everyone listed on that memorial wall down. You had the courage to support Shepard. Joker did. Garrus and Tally did. But Ashley didn't. Liara didn't. Were they cowards? I think not. Greg, you're one of the bravest and most 
loyal men I know. You were meant to be here right now. And I see that they're so taking turns giving each other therapy. Okay, okay, you win. It will not be mentioned again. How are we doing? Hello, Commander. Commander. I see. Over here, yeah, that's that way. Dun, dun, dun. Check the light support. There's no one in here, yeah. I mean, it's cool to see stuff here, but yeah, there's no one there. I should check Liara's room. Oh my god, good god, I'm making so many noises. will work, Rex. We just need to finish building the Crucible. Although I'd be interested to learn how you found out about it. Wasn't that hard. Lucky you keep this location more secret than the fact it exists. And I'm sure you'll do a good job of both, being so famous for your discretion. Hi, Val. My lips are sealed. Baby hunted herself her favorite toy. That's why she's- that's why you hear the cat crying in the background. Yeah. She just likes to announce that she caught her toy. Her favorite toy in the world is this little ribbon tube sewn up thing. It's just a string with cow print. And she's had it since she was a kitten. <coughs> and it's just her favorite thing in the world. Busy. I have time if you'd like to talk. In fact, I could use the distraction. What's on your mind? How long it took the Reapers to eradicate the Protheans, and how long they'll need for us. It took them centuries to conquer the Protheans. We're not quite so widespread, but it would still take at least 100 years. It's selfish, but I keep thinking that if we fail, I'm only 109, Shepard. I could live to see the entire cycle come to an end. Only a hundred and nine, huh? I know. It must seem strange to complain about a thousand year lifespan. I used to think it was sad that most aliens live such short lives. Maybe it's not such a privilege to outlive so many. To witness so much death. Don't drive yourself crazy about this, Liara. We're still in the fight. Only because you're still driving it forward. We finally have other leaders on our side, but none will take us as far as you can. Sometimes I wonder how you do it. I think of the people I care about. That helps keep me going. I'm glad I'm among them. I hope. Of course you are. I feel better already. Thank you for coming by, Shepard. Why don't we talk later? Of course. Warp unlocked. Available in the bay. Wow. Please Maybe enjoy your day. Thanks, Cliff. How did I unlock an ability? What did I do? What? <laughs> I'm so confused. Scaris so isn't here. So no one else is in here either. Where the fuck is Brent? Well, he might be on a Kerbin ship. Or, I know where I haven't checked. Let's see. Doctor, I'd like to hear the song. Again? Trying to calculate amino acid decay rate. You said you would once the tests were done. <sighs> oh, better to die to a thresher ball with shotgun blasting roaring war than to play ambassadorial games with the blood of Shiaka in her veins. Off to fight in Turian camp with diplomats instead of a grant, but she'll be true to Duchanka's dream and live and die a Krogan queen. For she is the Krogan queen, hurrah, hurrah for the Krogan queen. And it is, it is a glorious thing to be the Krogan queen. 
still prefer pet dog. Of course. I really had to twist your arm. I raised, I raised my relationship level with Liara. I mean, it's still amazing and kind of adorable. How are you doing, Eve? Oh, you didn't have to get up for me, darling. Something else, Commander? Oh god, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, I made you get up for nothing. Thanks for talking to me. It's my pleasure, Commander. At least I'm not like that's it. I'm not super Shepherd, mean to her. Eve, ready for travel to Tuchanka. Ah. Uh, so we did the right thing by saving the. I data? should go. Indeed, God. would be much harder to treat Eve without it. Maybe impossible. And all those experiments we saw back on Tuchanka. Uh. Monstrous, repulsive, but now with purpose. Victims didn't die for nothing. Nice talking with you, Morden. We'll be here if you need me. Continuing to study Shroud in meantime. I hated that, that there was, like, a good section of the game, that that was all I could say whenever I spoke to Garrus. It was like, oh, you're just going to thank me. And I don't need to be thanked. Thanks. There he is. That's what I thought. Alright. <clears throat> Let's save. I haven't done that in a hot moment. Oh. Yeah, I don't know why I never triggered it. I guess I didn't talk to people enough. Hmm. I could finish this one off. Power damage and duration. Hello, yes. Thank you, please. All the way up to the third bar. We only have two more bars to go on this one. The Reaper called Harbinger. Ah, Ravagers, Ravagers are former Rachni that the Reapers have transformed into oh, heavy yeah. artillery through a process of Plastic implantation gas, and genetic modification. As walking organic turrets, High they can sustain senses. and. Okay. Yeah, so next we're going to do. Let's see. This one. I save. I don't think I actually save, so let's save. Hello. There we go. Romancing Bane was the funniest. He warns you not to engage in membrane contact as girl skin emits a hallucinogenic toxin. Oh no! <laughs> oh no! I mean, that also eliminates some. Uh other sexual activities as well. But yeah. <laughs> yeah. Service infections. If you swallow, it could be fatal. Yeah. 
Interstacy's romances are complicated. Stay in some full suicide bitch. <laughs> it shouldn't be as funny as it is, but it is. Where am I? Arcturus stream? Okay. Pally's one isn't as funny because it's more like actual medical advice. Ah, uh, yeah. She might get sick after all that jazz. Actually, she's bound to get sick after. I found something. Oh. Tali has a big blue type thing after that and sniffles inside her helmet. But can't wipe her nose. She's adamant it was worth it. Oh. Baby, that's cute. Can tell from the Battle of Arcturus. Alright. I should also be able to. Without. <laughs> Let's go. I mean, it does make sense. She would think it was worth it. Uh, Signal confirmed. I hear that Garrus is the straight woman's equivalent of Tally dynamic wise in terms of being cute in a certain heteronormative way. Eh, yeah, I could see that. I could definitely see that. Ah, I can finally get answers about Benning over here. Enter Orda. Aww. That would be really cute. Are there a lot of, um, coded romances like that? Or are they one of the only ones? Aww. That's kind of adorable. Alright, who should I take here? Joker and Evie happens unless you forget it. <laughs> Joker's got a girlfriend. Joker's got a girlfriend. <laughs> Hello. Hello again. How are you doing? No, not the shoulder. That's my face. That's my keyboard. You can lay down. No, not the shoulder. 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 Ah. <sighs> <laughs> you can only imagine how awkward the sex and the conversations surrounding sex are for Joker and Edie. I mean, she's okay. As long as... Thank you for trying. She's kind of in a really awkward spot to remove. Come on. Okay. Nope, nope. Not the shoulder. 
I don't mind if you want to lay down. <laughs> I really don't mind if you want to lay down. But you kind of have to choose to lay down and not lay on my keyboard and not climb up my shoulder. Because if you decide to climb up my shoulder, then you're just going to start eating my thing. If you lay on my keyboard, you won't play my thing. Yeah, she's getting low. She's purring. I don't know if I don't know if my mic is sensitive enough to pick up her her purring, but it is a she she is a exceptionally purry cat. Uh, I haven't pulled James out in a while, mostly because he's a dude, bro. But I should pull him out every so often. So. This mission seems as good a time as any. Uh, hey, don't slap my keyboard with your tail. Who else? <laughs> okay. <laughs> I, 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 uh, I, I support this. I do generally like having one biotic and one um non in my parties, so her Alright. Let me double check my weapons lines. Yep, that's good. I mean, that's the more useful than. Yeah, okay. So let's do that. That's right, I gave him a particle rifle. And seeing it in action, it was worthwhile because. Um, definitely recommend picking up a better pistol at the Citadel with a little chunk of that. Yeah! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I have a I mean, upgrade, ultralight. Damn it. God damn it. Two of them. I wish we could just kind of preemptively ban, like, at this point, anything with a boss. I, I don't. If you know anything about fish right now, you ain't gonna make a boss name. And, uh, it would be nice if we could just get rid of them. Like, as an account, wild card out. Why do I give him that? What should I give you instead? Matic? I'll give you the Matic. Lock shot or a shot of rock salt. God, at this point, probably rock salt because they're like a demon infestation. That's dangerous and I love it. Uh, 
All right. Chainsaws. <laughs> ah, uh, yes. Do a radius and then China Lake grenade launcher. Hmm. Tempting. Very tempting. Capacitate. And then... Weapon damage? Yeah. Alright. And... Drop it. Power damage, do you like to use your powers? So we'll do that. Alright. I have no points, you boys have a point. Confirm. Handily. Shepard, server strike squads have infiltrated one of the major cities on Benning. Initial reports indicated they were recruiting civilians, but further investigations suggest that the people are being taken against their will. For what purpose? Unknown. We sent a recon team to investigate and the Cerberus squads reacted by targeting civilians <laughs> in public facilities. Officially, Cerberus is denying responsibility and condemning the action. They're either lying, or we're dealing with a rogue faction. And innocents are caught in their crosshairs. Exactly. Security areas are re-establishing rescue Pump action grenades? Wow. Approaching the drop point, Commander. Copy that, Lieutenant. That sounds terrifying. The people down there are counting on you, Commander. Pack it out. Alright. Building an avalanche of civilian SOS requests, Commander. The bulk are concentrated on the upper street. Yeah, I don't have as many key controls as last night. On my way. Keep me Last updated. night got a pain in the ass trying to do uh, the game and have the cat attacking my arm. Well, I say attacking, but uh. Excuse me. Okay, I need to go that way. So. Oh god. What did you get shot by? Maybe since that's the map, guys got skilled with it. Good enough. Holy shit. That sounds terrifying. Oh gosh. Oh god. Okay. You're a pointy bean. That's oh God. damn. This place is a maze! Uh, 
this is a shower block. Well, you got shot. Great. Thanks, scripted cutscene, I was guessing. I just Hold on, Commander. What is it, Lieutenant? I'm tracking civilians fleeing the city with Cerberus troops right behind. Where are they? Updating your nav point. You can intercept them there. They won't know what hit them. I just know that this place has at least one side quest piece of info that I need to get. About what the hell happened in Benning. So I'm trying to be careful about not missing anything. This place is exceptionally maze ish. Huh? Oh god. Am I just running around? I assume that's part of why it was a good multiplayer map. Stay calm. What? What should we do? Just stay down. Commander, more Cerberus troops are heading your way. If you can hold the line there, it'll give the civilians time to escape. You heard it. You hold here. Why did we die? We died together. <laughs> uh. Come on, pop your little head up. Ah. Yeah, no one's getting through me. Unless it's with a uh, grenade, one of those might get through me. Nah. Have a little bit more faith. Oh god, they're a moving target now. Oh god, oh god, oh god. <laughs> yeah, he doesn't need that anymore. That's what he gets for being part of Cerberus. Killed that guy by shooting his arm off.
Where are you guys going? Over here? Okay, great spot. Love it. Where is the centurion? Fuck you. Damn. Good work, everyone. I'll pick you up at the LZ, Commander. What? What? <clears throat> did, 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 did I miss the, the stuff I needed? Her helmet. Oh, I missed that. Okay, that's that. <laughs> Is there more to the bending mission? Because... leave if I've missed the thing that I need to get here. So I don't know if I can come back, but it seems like I've scoured this place and I can't see where it would be. So I went back here again. Well, I, I guess I guess there has to be more mission because I still don't know what happened to the man's son. Damn. Uh, oh gosh. Okay. Mission. We're getting reports of continuing strikes against okay. other cities on Benning. Cerberus still denying responsibility? 
Yes, and for once we're inclined to believe them gunning down innocent humans isn't their usual M.O. Either way, the civilians down there have a chance now. We're solidifying the foothold and getting people out, then we'll move to liberating the rest of the planet. I hope we can say the same for Earth. One day, Commander. For now, we've got our work cut out for us. Carry on. First vision. Hmm. Well, that had to be the minimum. Commander, Chief Engineer Adams would like to speak with you down in engineering. Okay. Oof. Something just scared the crap out of Suki. There's your capacitor helmet. So, sort of? But also not really. Hallway noises? Ah, uh, gotcha. Nothing like hallway noises to make your day complete. Project. Okay. I can invite Liara up. Oh. Oh dear. Go down to engineering, see what they want. Ugh. Hey, did you know that people exist? Yeah, I know. Edie doesn't pilot the Normandy. She is the Normandy. No, she's a passenger in the Normandy, just like us. The ship was a space-bearing vessel before Edie even existed. Engineer Donnelly is correct. The Normandy SR2 was completely spaceworthy prior to my installation. Now, oh. see, Edie agrees with me. Edie's mind and the Normandy are a whole entity now. You couldn't just move the processors and the AI core to another ship. Engineer Adams is correct. Processes that contribute to my self-awareness are spread throughout the ship. See, Edie agrees with me. But unlike Edie, our brains couldn't have existed without our bodies. That is a requisite from being organic. You have to look beyond that limited definition of life. Joker pilots the Normandy. He doesn't take over Edie's body when he does that. When Edie controls the ship, she is piloting, just like Joker. Edie doesn't pilot the Normandy. She is the Normandy. No, she's a passenger in the Normandy, just like us. The ship was a space-bearing vessel before Edie even existed. Engineer Donnelly is correct. The Normandy SR2 was completely safe. At this point, Edie and the Normandy are See, Edie agrees with me. Edie's not mind and the Normandy separable. are a whole entity now. You couldn't just move the processors and the AI core to another ship. Edie can direct the Normandy with her thoughts. She sees, hears, and feels through the ship's sensor arrays. The Normandy is her body. I've seen Edie's body. And its curves are a fine sight better than the Normandy's hull. So what do you think, Edie? Are we more than our thoughts? I'm done. Any more of this and my <laughs> head's gonna explode. Adams would like to speak to you. You should go see Adams, Commander. Commander, remember the problem I mentioned? About a core overload possibly venting into the engineering compartment? Daniel, Donnelly, Edie, and I have been brainstorming and comparing notes. 
You see, the venting occurs when IES sinks are in a back cycle. At the same moment, the main core is at peak draw, such as from sustained kinetic. What Kenneth means to say is that we're pretty sure we can make the system safer. We just need a GX-12 thermal pipe. Unfortunately, we're cut off from Alliance supply chains. Could you keep an eye out for one the next time you're on the Citadel, Commander? I've got the specs right here. I'll look for one the next time we go to the Citadel. Thanks, Commander. Cool. Another one of those types of quests. Yeah, I'm good with that. Okay. Now let's go see what Liara wants, because... I don't know what she needs to talk with you about, but sure. Liara, you had something you wanted to discuss in my cabin? Yes, I'll be right up. Um, what, what, what? Come on in. Uh. Thank you. Could we this, sit? This music is very sad. This music I've been is thinking about the knowledge sad. we gathered on the Reapers, and how easily it could be lost again. So, I put a plan in motion to preserve things for the future. What's this? A record of the galaxy. Information on the Reapers, relays, different cultures, and blueprints of the Crucible. But there's one entry I wanted your opinion on. Which one? Your own. Oh. I'd be honored to have your input. How would you like history to remember you? Fifty thousand years is a long time for a computer to sit around. Please, I was an archaeologist. I know what I'm doing. Well, I'm introducing these records in time capsules and seeding copies on multiple planets. And while it's not foolproof, the <laughs> VI I'm installing has every translation and linguistics program I could find. So it's an information guide like Vigil on Ilos? Yes. I've been preparing it for some time. And it will be a privilege to guide the future discoverers of these records. Have you decided what you would like Dr. Tassoni to write in your entry, Commander? You know me well enough to fill in the blanks, Liara. Are you sure? Yeah. I'd like it to be your call. All right. Let's begin with the fact that Earth's most famous officer was born and raised in space. Shepard was also a deadly tactical fighter. Most enemies never saw her coming. She was a soldier and a leader, one who made peace where she could. And it was a privilege to know her. Careful this doesn't sound like a diary. I can't help myself. You're a good friend, Shepard. Oh, shut up. <laughs> I try. I really do. You've been there for me too, Liara. No, I haven't. I wish I could have joined you back on Ilium. You made up for it. Well, I suppose I did just write your name in the stars. Yeah. That was... sad. And touching. But also sad. Okay, um, can you grab the cat now? I am overheating from cat. She's not being a problem, I'm just way too warm. She's so funny, she doesn't want to go. I'm gonna find her. Go cuddle with, cuddle with Kenneth. She's a good thing. I need hamster. I do. I need tiny little hamster scoops. Oh. Why do cats have to run? It's so hot. Like, I love them. They're wonderful. And on a cold night, they're wonderful. But when you generally run warm, 
sometimes it's torture to be cuddling a cat. Commander. Okay. Let's look at the service attack. There's nothing else I can do. Um, burning for now. Um, I have one more mission to do before I go shopping, actually. And then I'll go shopping. Let's grab the swords here. Well, that was over ten, but yeah. That's really interesting. Is it over here? This one. Yeah. See, yeah, I just have to jump in. Okay. Ugh. <laughs> eh, let's look at sticky grenade. Damage or impact radius. Oh, let's go for impact radius on that one. There we go. <clears throat> Blech. Ow. Oof. Oof. Okay. When you only have five of them, you end up having a lot of the same pairs, which is fine. I don't mind. Pretty sure I've gotten these up to date recently. Oh, oh yeah. Shepard Services landing forces away from the Tachunka battlefields. Their target seems to be an ancient ground to space cannon facility that hasn't been used since the Krogan rebellions. The site has no obvious military advantage, and the Krogan are spread too thin to deal with it. Do we know what Cerberus is up to? No, but we do know that Cerberus doesn't act without a plan. Get in there, stop them. Find out what they're up to while you're at it. We'll get it done. Yes, See sir. To it. Pack it out. Looks like Cerberus got that cannon operational, Commander. I'll go back up, get a read on what they're shooting at. Get on it. Just All right, let's don't. find the control room for those cannons. Kill anything that way. This I can do. Another multiplayer map. Oh. What is this? Jump. That. Uh, am I timed now? Ah!
Wow, this is not very good cover. You don't get to try to loop behind me. What the fuck? Stop ragdolling. Enjoy the rest of your evening too, Serenissima. I hope you enjoy the uh, churches and the other stuff you have to do tomorrow. And if you have any really cool pictures, feel free to throw them in the server. Oh yeah, the D&D! Good luck with the D&D group. I hope they're awesome. No toxic players for you. Found the control room. Damn it. Well, I didn't want to come down here, but I'm down here now. Ah, there you are, friend. Control center secure. And I think it's time to test this cannon. <laughs> Kind of Krogan relic I expected to find. Um. Um. Oh. much of a nemesis if she can be one shot. What's what behind me? What? What room was it in? Okay. <laughs> oh shit. Oh, cannon controls. Okay. Javik. 
<laughs> what? Damn. Worth a shot. Mm, that must not be actual ammo. That is, though. Why am I not? There we go. Interesting that they bleed blue. Or they blue splotches, anyway. <laughs> ah! <laughs> ah, that's amazing. shooting at me. Do I have to do two of those? Oh, there's two modules right next to each other. Okay. Yep. Combat engineers explode. Shot that man's face off. Did I get two on one? I think so. I will get that frickin'. Welch. Oh, hello. Damn! That one didn't count as a male thought. Ow. I mean, with the power of this gun, I am sort of Where'd you go, buddy? Stop it. Stop it. <sighs> oh, gonna need more ammo soon. Pretty 
much just like murdering them with their own shield. <laughs> Two more. Damn. Yeah, where the fuck was I pointed? <laughs> Commander, cruiser initiating bombardment. Cannon control restored. Targeting enabled. Coordinates, Lieutenant. Uploaded. Firing. Work, everyone. That was fun. Shepard, with those Krogan cannons operational, Cerberus has actually given us the advantage in that system. The enemy's pulling back, but we think they'll try to seize the facility again. Seems likely. I'm sending an Alliance team to keep it secure. They've got a foothold in a strong defensive position, thanks to you. Good. Glad to hear it. Good work, Commander. Hack it out. Wish we could have done the same for the uh, Turians before they got hit. That would have been nice, but unfortunately, and only take what we can get. Krogan, Krogan First Division. <laughs> Occasional bottle wrinkle. Opening up things in multiplayer. Ah. Alright. Yes, Commander. That's all. Sorry. Of course, Commander. Didn't mean to bug you. So, what have my little friends got to talk about now? I had a buddy who got discharged. Category six after Eden Prime. Six? Damn. Well, if I'd been on Eden Prime, I'd have lost it too. He fought it, said he was still fit for duty. Last thing he told me was that he was joining Cerberus. Oof. I'm sorry, bud. Your friend is probably dead. Well, maybe he's lucky. There, there's a chance. The Turians will hold. Pound for pound, they're the best fighting force in the galaxy. Pound for pound is irrelevant, given the significantly <laughs> higher mass of Reaper forces overall. That's why we're bringing in the Krogan. Commander. How's the ship running, Edie? I am updating the cyber warfare suite around our Reaper IFS. It should resemble Reaper code exactly. Oh, good, 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 I think. All right. Commander. Wrong way. Sorry. Yeah, right? Somehow I look like a Reaper ship, and yet, I am still a danger. Commander. Oh, nothing new for you to say, huh? Oh. Oh, oh my gosh. Bad fish. I did just talk to a bunch of people a few minutes before. Uh... Let's go. 
check shit out on the Citadel. And possibly, um, do you have a suggestion for a better, um, what's it called? Dom? Paladin or the Eagle. Oh, do I have enough money for this? I bet I do. I think I wanted the Eagle. Carnifex and Edge. Ah! <laughs> Alliance docks. Thank you, please. You're cleared to dock, Normandy. Do you need ground transport? Uh, no thanks. We'll start at the top and move yes, down. Commander. Just kind of want to scan. Oh, that's new. Previously, it was that they had abandoned the Hades Gamma, and now it's that they have. Man, this is just giving Cerberus an even worse name, you know? Like, God. Welcome, Commander Shepard. Please Shepherd select the destination. One Go to the holding area. We'll just work our way down and check now for bay E24. conversations, now quests, etc. The line keeps getting smaller every time I'm here, I swear. Which is good, I think. The Volvus homeland? A ship. Weather satellite. The pipe you need for Donnelly? Wait, what? I noticed these red dots on Garshaw. Mm. Thought it just... Yeah. ...stared in the sun. Then I saw the smoke. Reaper ships. Bastards. Ah, uh, they're making friends, I guess. Sort of. Poor guy. Alright. How are you doing, sir? Thank you, human. We will hold the pillars so close to our hearts. 
hearts. Welcome to Vitarian State Arms. Mm, not aware that I have a desire. I just keep expecting, like, this is an empty space, expecting something to be there. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't mean to run into you. Volus. They have so few places they can live comfortably already. Sorry, I didn't mean to run into you either. Oh. Hey, I've assumed full control of Eclipse, and we're committed to moving forward with Arya. Hi, Garrus. Nothing to say to me right now? Okay. Hello. You're just hiding in here. Creepy. I hope things are going okay for you. Yeah, they're not common. Uh, doesn't look like there's anything new here. Just a little bit of conversation between the Batarian and the human. Uh... Which is, I like the conversations, they make me happy. Um, so what's the next level? I go from... Welcome, Commander Shepard. Might be some stuff on it. Oh yeah, there's at least a gun. But what I need is proof. I can't tell me you have found my son. Not yet. My apologies. Thank you for looking. I really hope I didn't miss that bullshit. I may have, though. Thank you again, Earth Clan. Our military strength is minimal, but we are proud to help as we can. Allies are allies, guys. Can't really pick and choose at this Hello, point. Madam. What can I do for you today? <laughs> you remind me. <sighs> okay. Um, anyone up here to talk to? Let's see how Commander Bailey is doing. You might have something new or interesting to say. It never rains, but it pours, eh, Shepard? That bad, huh? Things here are getting tense. So many refugees scuttling about, rumors flying about the war. People are walking around, eyeballing each other, oh, and we can't keep up grief. with the reports so on sorry, suspicious Zuki. behavior. I'm so sorry, baby. I kicked you. Oh, I'm so mean. You were sleeping on my blanket. Aww. What's the Citadel's pulse regarding the war? I think all the reports are starting to sink in. You can only live in denial so long. You either wake up or die. Either way. Yeah. You know, one good thing about people having their heads up their asses is the quiet. No, there's no more quiet. Everybody's openly suspicious of everybody else, and they're not timid about yelling about it. Is the immigration situation any better? <laughs> it's worse. The more destruction the Reapers sow, the more ships come looking for salvation. The strain in our resources is overwhelming. You got loved ones out there? Somewhere. Ex-wife I lost track of, and... and a son and daughter. They're still on Earth. I'm sorry, Bailey. Yeah, I'm just like everyone else. 
I'm losing myself and things I can control. And at the moment, that means creating the illusion of security here. We both have jobs to do, Bailey. I suggest we do them. Yep. Good talking to you, Shepard. I mean, you got a better desk. It looks comfier. Alright. You better. Spectre terminal, nothing new. Alright, so I have the body bump up. The power bump and Let's go for the evil. Shush working for service, of course, right? So you can pick up some things you miss. Oh! Oh! Oh my god, I missed it! Fuck! How did I miss it? I'm so mad. I scoured that mission. I mean, yes, it's 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 not expensive. I'm just ah, uh, I scoured that mission. It was somewhere. I missed it, and I'm mad that I missed it. That's all. Uh, so we'll buy this, and we'll buy. It moved back on itself. It was like a fucking Taurus made of an Ouroboros. Er. No, it's the thing that person wants to say. Of course. Uh, can't remember the. Mobius strip, yes. Thank you. Thank you. That that's exactly what I was trying to think of. So yeah, buy that. And we'll get the shotgun to Still have some money. Uh let's go see how the eagle works. He always got lost with him in that one. I mean, that. I'm not gonna lie, that makes me feel a little bit better. <laughs> uh. Oh, yeah. A little bit heavier. Better fire rate. A little bit lower damage. A little bit lower accuracy. I think. the heavy barrel on it. Oh, okay. Yeah, I like her. Button shock thing. Ah, okay. Uh, probably that one's a little better one. Uh, let's go 
Let me check if this is exactly as I want it. Okay, not bad. Yeah, not bad. <clears throat> yeah, that's indeed as I want it. <laughs> Yeah. I can hear you crunching through my headphones. Way too close. Ah. Oh. Okay. I see. I see. Yeah, I guess so. Which is fine. You can do single shots or you can do multi shots. I kind of like that. More versatility. Alright, let's go talk to the man. Okay, let me swoop over here. Something's gonna end up happening over here. As to. There's no reason for it to be here unless it's just a, a thing. Jogging along. And I can like run forever on the Citadel. Welcome, Commander Shepard. Uh, Please select the destination. Oh wait, no, he was here. Duh. And a dude. Yes, I have spoken to you. Have you found my son? I found your son's body in the slums on Benning. He sacrificed himself to save his squad. I uh, see. Their guilt made them avoid me. They should feel honored by his sacrifice. I... I know that I do. Thank you, my friend. You're welcome. Oh yeah, that's some nice experience. And some reputation. Welcome I assume reputation is a good please thing. Select the destination. Uh, One moment, please. I don't expect much of anything. Oh wait, I might have now arriving at ward level So I thought about talking to Commander Bailey some more about that guy scamming the refugees. Really? What'd he say? I think I have a power grid for the lady here. Don't mean to interrupt, but I found these schematics. They're pretty old, but maybe they could help you. Oh, those really are old, but solid. We could totally convert our current systems to them. Thanks. Amazing. Yeah, I'm just, I was just going down the list step by step so I don't miss anything. Oh, good. Seriously, hook me up here. I had a few on the way in, but I need something cheap and fruity, like you. 
Listen, Mel. And then I want to see dancers, and not just crappy pole work. Mel. Like, take the raunchiest thing you can imagine, and then add a hanar hanging on somewhere. Mel. Listen, the guys are kind of weirded out by you being here. This is vaguely distressing to listen. She's like totally more of a she's like yeah I'm, I'm down for all this stuff and they're just like oh you're a girl oh that's those hi dude Salud. nothing to do here with you I guess all right Are your pants assless? Do you have assless pants, woman? Are those assless pants? I don't think I've seen that outfit before. Okay. <laughs> Sorry for focusing intently on the uh, pants there, but I was a little startled. That man is drunk off his ass. You know, that's the one thing I don't know what fe what it feels like. I have never been that drunk. Welcome, Commander Shepard. Please select one him. moment, please. Now arriving at Puerta Memorial Hospital. I mean, I don't judge anyone either way because, you know, but. Hey, hey. Coming by again, Shepard. I'm flattered. Oh. You got the reverse brain chemistry, ADD. Boost makes you hyper. Oof. <laughs> I wish the best for you, Thane. And I for you. Do not grieve for me. I have good doctors. The My son times, visits regularly. Um, Perhaps we will keep up via the extranet now that you are free. Until we meet again, Shepard. Um, a few times I even get like tipsy or whatnot. It's just sort of like... Ah, things are great. I get kind of cuddly. I got out of that farm and into the hills. I pulled the farm girl after me. All I wanted to do was live through the night. Nobody else could have done more. Mm. But morning came and no shuttle. Afternoon and then night and hiding from husks and those Turian things. The file says the evacuation team thought your position was overrun. So after two days, I still don't have a gun because those Turian things I can't use theirs. I realize that shuttle isn't coming. Not unless I get back to the farm and my radio. And the farm girl? She was with me. Even killed a few husks. <laughs> with a stick. <laughs> well, this is going to end badly. For the farm girl, probably. Alright. Welcome to Serta. Uh, sure. Thank you for coming to Serta. Can we help you? I swear I've already bought that, but you know what? Whatever. Oh. Um. I should do that more work. Uh oh. Hey, Someone said it. Thank you. I love snuggling kitties. Also, hello. How are you doing this evening? <clears throat> ah, my jaw. Anything here? Nope, nothing there. 
locked into that door. Tell Matriarch Athena that our huntresses should have the upgrades waiting for them on their next shore leave. No, they were very easy to fail. The humans made some amazing breakthroughs. Okay. Ah. Keep walking into doors almost. The timeline is reasonable? Excellent. No, not at all. I'm just glad we'll be able to help your people. Good. I'm doing good things everywhere. Hi, Doctor. Didn't expect to see you again so soon. Well, we need to prescribe you another round of antibiotics. But when I ship out? I have some bad news. Your squad applied Ah, so that directly. one's looped around. Okay. Let's go check on... Uh... Oh, she's gone. Ashley's gone. Okay. Um. I wonder if I should look for her in his office. Maybe. Welcome, Commander Shepard. All right. Down to comments. Yeah, she might be there too. One place now arrive at the Presidium Okay. And I gotta check all the shops while I'm here for a pipe. Pipe, pipe, pipe. Welcome to Kanala Export. Fish. Fish. I need these. We believe that a peaceful heart is a strong heart. Cultivating serenity is possible even during times of crisis. Kanala Exports is pleased to offer goods for security and peace of mind. Hmm. Cultivating serenity is possible even during times of crisis. Thank you for shopping at Kanala Exports. Hmm. Welcome to Elkos Combine Arsenal Supplies. I'm assuming this is what I need. Can only be returned for store credit. Elkos Combine. If it exists, we carry it. Don't get left out in the cold. Ask about our full service warranties. Any opened goods can only be returned for store credit. Thank you. Come again. Ish. Oh. Oh, it's transit. I think I might lose the anger with him. Things weren't great even before he deployed, and if I pretend to be I happy over the Matriarchs aren't going to do anything to you, especially in the middle of this damn war. My reports don't show much activity from the Asari military against the Reapers. Come on, you know how Asari work. Infiltration and sabotage. But against Reaper forces, that's... That is useful as tits on a hand are. <laughs> Hello, Edie. I have noticed many displays of public affection on the Citadel. The rate seems disproportionately high. Everybody could die tomorrow, Edie. Looking up is one of the few things they can do. I wonder if this is how the Krogan feel. Possible. Welcome to Casa Fabrication Weaponry. <laughs> All goods have been marked down with our special wartime discount. Casa Fabrication Weaponry hasn't forgotten Earth. Neither should you. Nothing to say, Joker? Well, okay. Shop. All proceeds from today's purchase. 
apprentices go toward the starting oh, no. block effort. Oh, that's a lovely idea. I really appreciate management's work. Excuse me. I'm sorry. You need to hear this. Oh, Blue Rose of Ilium. If these humble words reach you, then I have joined my ancestors. Oh. No, no, no. My dream was to be by your side, a weed beside your beauty, twining together in the warm Tachanka sun. Oh, Char. But if my last days must be with Krant instead of kindness, still I will remember the perfume of your scent and the soft touch of your petals. <sighs> Let my broken bones build a wall around your garden so you and the flower we planted together can grow safe and strong thank you uh, I should I need to go I need to go stands there welcome to Nosostra sporting good <laughs> Shoot smart. Shoot, no Sastra. She needs to figure out how to walk again. Fair. Thank you for shopping at no that is very fair. Welcome to Cipertine Armory. Huh. Citratine Armory products include a lifetime guarantee for performance. See our extranet site for details. Professional grade equipment at reasonable prices. We appreciate prices. your visit. That's Citratine. Welcome to Agor Munitions. Thank you for shopping at Agor Munitions. I'm the sanctuary. We can keep you safe. Doubtful. I am expecting that one of my missions would be to rescue sanctuary. Or put it down as a horrible, horrible Cerberus plot. Muscular allies wipe out the Reapers. Idiots who paid through the Cloaca to get to Sanctuary will have nothing. I, however, will be rolling in credits and future ex wives. Well, if you say so, maybe I. Maybe I won't go to Sanctuary. Now you get it. Trust me, Sarah. You'll thank me later. Hmm. That's debatable. Mm, nothing there. I mean, I don't think that... Oh yeah, Sanctuary. Sanctuary is definitely, definitely something not great. I don't know what is not great about it, but it's not great. I know that. Well, I don't know it, but I, yup, I suspect it extremely strongly. Let's phrase it that way. Welcome, Commander Shepard. Please select a destination. I talked her out of it for the wrong reasons, but it worked. Yeah, that's true. Do I not have to dismiss the character? I popped that in on here.
may have done a lot of missions, so... Should be Shepherd. able to please select the destination. One moment, please. Go give the fight. Now arriving at docking bay D twenty four. Where? Where? Thanks, Commander. That GX-12 thermal pipe arrived. We're performing the modifications right now. So, how did I get volunteers to uh. go through the ducts? You're the power control engineer, not me. Damn hot in here. Hey, didn't Adam say that all the Normandy is eating? Kenneth, stop right there. Just didn't tell Joker. He'll get jealous. Still working on the thermal modifications. Should be done pretty soon. Amazing. Amazing. Okay. Uh, let's go look at my collection of fish. Uh, oh man, look at these fish. Isn't it neat? What if you think my collection's complete? Except it's not. I'm missing fish. They're very cool though. They make me happy. Um. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know who gets the I don't know who gets the turret schematics. Seems like my next quest is the Tachanka one. Do I have enough time for that before you need to head off, Elixir? Or should I say that? Okay. Let's say... Save game. Alright, before I do that, I am going to go to the bathroom.
Alright. Think. Think. Oh my god. Ah. Saving content. Oh. Hi, pal. Hi, baby. Hi. Kitty cat pets. Yeah. Yeah. How are you? I want to play with you, baby. You can ask Kittlefish, maybe. But I cannot. Well, well. Okay. Let's do this. <laughs> yeah, it's on the left side. <laughs> All right. Let's do this. All hands, full stop. Hostiles detected at the no. landing coordinates. Joker, what have you got? Sensors show a Reaper parked at the Shroud facility. No way you're going to be able to land a shuttle there. Get everyone assembled in the war room. I want eyes on the Shroud. Aye, aye, ma'am. Well, that's a New problem. New form of Reaper Shepard using Shroud to poison Tuchanka's atmosphere. Problematic. They want to fight. They just got one. Primark, we're gonna need your help. That could be difficult. Our losses on Palavin have been catastrophic. We're doing this for Palavin. No one said it would be easy. What do you have in mind? A combined attack. Your people hit the Reaper with an airstrike. Rex, at the same time, your soldiers will be attacking from the ground. Together, you can draw it away from the tower. Yes, distraction. Small team can reach Shroud facility. Finish synthesizing cure. We'll need Eve to come with us. Okay. We've never faced a Reaper up close like this. Everyone on board? There's even a doubt. Let's move, Pijack. It's time to cure the Genophage. Commander, incoming message marked urgent. I'll put it in the common for you. Great. What now? Dalatras. Commander Shepard, we know you've reached Tuchanka. And by now, I imagine Morden Solis has proposed using the Shroud. You spying on us? Hardly. The Shroud is the only viable course of action open to you. Commander, you can't allow your misguided sympathy for the Krogan to cloud your judgment. Do you honestly believe curing the Genophage will end in lasting peace? We have to give the Krogan that chance. We can't condemn an entire race to extinction based on what might happen. What will happen is the Krogan will reproduce out of control. We uplifted them specifically for their violent nature, not their diplomatic skills. Another war is inevitable. What do you want, Dalatras? Years ago, our operatives sabotaged the Shroud facility to ensure what you are planning couldn't be done. Morden will likely detect this malfunction and repair it. But if you ensure that he doesn't, then the cure's viability will be altered just enough so that it fails. No one will notice the change. You mean trick the Krogan? They need not be any the wiser. Let Erdnot Rex believe you fulfilled your promise. Morden would never stand for that. How you deal with him is up to you, Commander. We can provide you our very best scientists to build the Crucible and the full support of our fleets. If I sabotage the cure. Think about it, Commander. The choice is yours. I mean... Here's the thing, Balatras. What proof do you have that I don't sabotage it?
Mm-hmm. Oh no, I've been expecting something like that. So it's it's not a it's not a terrible surprise. I mean, I would hope that she would have come around, but I didn't expect it. Okay, so for this mission, um, I know I just pulled him out, but I'm gonna say Javik and Liara because he's our main. Reaper informant, and she's our scientist. Unless someone has a second suggestion. Well, pretty sure I have. Seems good. Okay. Good. Good, 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 good. Um. Where's the light at shut? This one? Mainly seeing if I can. I know I probably won't be able to. Yeah, that's still very heavy. Besides, I have a new gun to test out anyway. Yeah, I really didn't do that much. Probably either have to get better materials. I mean, honestly. All the weight's coming from this. But I am not ditching the widow. Yeah, yeah, definitely. It can one-shot most creatures, and if not one-shot, that's pretty much two. Um, I think the only thing that requires more than two are the atlases, and if I cloak, I'll probably take that down too. Which is pretty much a clip for the Widow, so... It works for me. Oh yeah, harvesters. Uh, and bricks. I forgot about both of those guys. Yeah, those are the heavy hitters. And, uh, still does a number. Especially if I remember to cloak more often and shoot them out of it. Um, let's see if I have something better for this than just material weight. Added damage. May as well go for added damage, it's a little bit better. Especially since they don't actually seem to be affected by weight. They don't have like a weight gauge like I do. I mean, I'm not sure. Savages are relatively hard in this human uniforms. That's fair too. You have five points. We can look at that. Warp. Oh yeah, let's do warp. Force, damage, impact, radio, combo, detonation, uh, yeah, sure. Sure, I think. You don't have enough points for anything. Could we even have those points? 
back to our other way to the fourth bar. I've ordered the clans to assemble at the Hollows. It's our sacred meeting ground. We'll land there and take an armored convoy against the Reaper. This will be the defining moment of Krogan history. Krogan history filled with defining moments, most bloody. Hope this one better. <laughs> yeah. Commander, you seem troubled. I got a message from them. <sighs> Rex, it's Reeve. The Reapers are already at the hollows. Come out, oh. guns blazing. Hang on tight. We're heading in. Good. Ah, great way to start. Shepard, keep them away from the female. I'll sort out what's happening with the other clan. Oof. Everyone pick your targets and keep an eye on our six. Now move. Oh. The enemy is approaching. Hey, guess what? They are fucking... Whoops. What? What? That glitched. We have to get to the Shroud. The airstrike is on its way. Female safe, Shepard. Vitals are strong. What's a Solarian doing here? Nobody said anything about this. Multiple Krogan. Problematic. Who are you? Erdnot Reed, brood brother to our illustrious leader. <laughs> Reeve and I share the same mother and nothing else. For which I'm thankful. I remember what it means to be a true Krogan. We flay our enemies alive and drown them in a geyser of their own blood. You don't invite them into our home. Lovely. I'm so glad that I didn't end up killing Rex. This Solarian is not your enemy. He's here to help cure the genophage. His kind gave us the genophage. Why should we trust him? Because I do. And so will you. You know, I could one-shot you, buddy. Thank you. Calm our souls shall prevail. You can stay here and let old wounds fester as Krogan have always done. Or you can fight the enemy you were born to destroy and win a new future for our children. I choose to fight. Who will join me? I will. And so will I. Now hold your heads high like true Krogan. There's a reaper that needs killing! <laughs> Point. Shepard out. Reeve isn't the only Krogan who wants revenge for the genophage, Rex. 
You'll have to placate them somehow. <laughs> have to return some of our old territory. We'll need room to expand. Recapture the glory of the ancients. Glory of ancients led to Krogan Rebellion. Countless deaths. Creation of genophage. Expansion plan problematic. What were the ancient Krogan like? Tachanka wasn't always a wasteland. In the old times, the Krogan were a proud people. We had dreams, a future to look forward to. Until Solarian interference. No, we destroyed Tachanka ourselves. Technology changed us. It made life too easy. So we looked for new challenges and found them in each other. Nuclear war was inevitable. But now our planet is rubble. We'll need a better place to live. <sighs> I'd say helping defeat the Reapers would be worth a new planet. Or ten. You haven't seen how fast we can pop them out. Rex. What? With the Genophage Gert, we'll have a lot of catching up to do. Commander, on the shuttle, was there something you were going to say? The Dalatras tried to cut a secret deal with me. What kind of deal? She said they sabotaged the Shroud years ago. The cure won't work unless we fix it. Years ago, our operatives sabotaged the Shroud facility to ensure what you're planning couldn't be done. And she thought we wouldn't know better? Correctly. Would likely have fooled tests. But familiar with STG work, can adjust. Did not come this far for nothing. You just spared our race another genocide, Commander. I told you we could count on her. Why are we stopping? Why are we stopping? Excuse me. <laughs> yeah. I mean, that's very pretty. Rex, you and Morden stay with Eve. It's looking ugly. Oh, jeez. I. Uh. Ah! Your wheels just tried running me over. Oh, there it is. What's happening, Shepard? We can't sit around like this. Sorry, I'm taking pictures. Never seen the sky like that. I don't know what that is. Look at that Reaper. It's like the end of days out there. <laughs> Remember to bring it back when you're done. But nothing lasts. Hold up. Roads out. The convoy can't make it through. Turn I'm sorry, they were bouncing. Shepherd. We've been delayed. Hold off your attack. Negative commander, our approach is locked. The Reaper already knows we're here. An airstrike isn't enough against the Reaper. We must join the fight. Build a new road. We are going. Shepard. I've lost control. I can't pull up. No! It's dark. Rex, are you receiving this? Is everyone mm. okay? Yeah, just scratches. Nothing the Solarian can't patch up. Reeve's truck made it out too. 
The Turians had to call off the airstrike. We'll need a new plan for dealing with the Reaper. First, we'll have to find you. Where did you end up? Underground. We see ruins of some kind. Commander, that's the City of the Ancients. How do we get out? No maps exist. It's been abandoned for thousands oh, of yeah. years. I You're a trailblazer, Shepard. Get through there and we'll find a place to meet up. Nothing will stop this cure. Great, so we have... That's terrifying. I'm not going that way. <laughs> maybe, maybe, maybe that's where I'm supposed to go, but I'm sorry. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not going that. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. I don't like this. Also, I hear things in the dark and I don't like it. Uh. 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 You know, flashlights aren't much good if they don't actually illuminate anything. Great, I have two paths left or right. Uh, left or right, left or right, left or right, right. <laughs> that didn't feel like a quake. Rex, are you guys feeling these tremors? Not up here. It could be something else, Commander. It is said that Kalros, the mother of all Thresher Maws, lives in this region. Which is another reason to get your ass out of there, Shepard. Step on it. Kalros, the mother of all Thresher Maws. Sounds troubling. If the Krogan named it, it must be something special. Fascinating. This painting suggests Krogan had an artistic side. Notice they chose obedience as their subject. That's fine. Okay, so that was the way I was supposed to go. That's great. Well, good. I, I came back and got a Krogan religious artifact. Amazing. I'll have to jump across, jump down, jump down. Yeah. Yeah. I thought I was thought I was stuck, so that's why I went back. Um but Yeah, I'm not gonna bitch because I do not want to fight a thresher maw under fucking ground. Oh. Oh uh uh <laughs> Cool, but um Galros, I would guess. Impressive. If that's what we've been hearing down here, I suggest we get moving. Can 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 we sick the pressure maw on the Reaper? Like is that an option? get her to do our dirty work. Oh great. Is this another? Great. It is. Great. Okay, so... Thanks. Great. Okay, good. This one's blocked off. Thank God. Stop giving me a maze. Okay. Oh. Great. Rachni. There are bound to be more than just the ones we killed. Rex, we've got Rachni here. Keep an eye out. I know. A few of them just attacked us. Um, All that matters is getting to that shroud. Mine is fast. I mean, that'll take a bit, won't it? Well, yeah, that's fine. Duh. Yeah, no, that makes sense. Finally. Light ahead. Water? In my younger days, 
I would have loved to have spent time here studying these ruins. Remnants of a failed species. Dude, you're an asshole. Shut up. Krogan are not a failed species. Any species here has failed. It's you. Because you fucking died. Except for you. And you're a dick. Rex, we made it back outside. Well, if you can see sunlight, that's progress. And the color green. I thought plants were extinct around here. You're looking at hope. All that's left of it aren't a chunk. This is once a world full of beauty. Given a chance, it can be again. Shepard, that Reaper is still up to no good at the Shroud. Find a way out of there and we'll pick you up. We're on it. And when we get there, vengeance will be mine. Krogan statuary. Oh. This place is kind of beautiful. Amazing. Imagine how much Krogan culture has been lost. I see only waste here. A civilization that destroyed what it had. No Reapers were necessary. Maybe Eve is right. Curing the genophage might lead to a Krogan renaissance. Movement ahead. Once a civilized seed. Uh-huh. I mean, if I have to fight another Thresher Maw, I will. But I will not fucking enjoy it. Especially not a queen of fucking Thresher Maws. Starting to think that the Reaper is left out and not being able to fully assimilate the Protheans. The Reaper made from them probably would have annoyed the others to distraction. Oh, I don't know. Sounds kind of like the personality you might have gotten from mm, Sovereign. Important toaster. Problem solved. You're welcome. I think that's it for now. For now. But almost for now. Kind of glad that I managed to. I mean, the brute was. Shepard, how's it coming? We're still in the ruins. Get a move on. That Reaper hasn't moved, and the sky. Rex, you're right about Calron. Yeah, we've got some ideas on that. What? Not now, Rex. The commander has enough to worry What's about. What's happening? Some crazy idea we can talk about later. Just worry about getting out of there right now. So I infiltrator was one of the OP builds? Yeah, I can imagine. Take a breath because here they come! Okay. How? 
Vanguard, polar opposite. Oh, hello. There's two of them? That's cheating. Okay. Vanguard would charge in. In the enemy's face. <sighs> Lovely. Sorry for the small delay there. Thresher maws are subterranean carnivores that spend Spores. their entire lives eating or searching for something to eat. Threshers reproduce via spores that can... Hello? Yeah, that should be fine. Let's save in the middle here. All right. Shepard, we're coming under the bridge. Get down here, or we can get to the shroud. Wait, Kalros. Rex. Okay. Amazing. Hello. I hear truck noises. Go on ahead, Shepard. We'll try to shake this thing and find you. Death trap. These Krogan seem to have only one talent destruction. 
even of their own home. The genophage was a necessity. I wonder where we are now. A memorial of some kind. Interesting. Ahead of us! I have them in sight. A bad gun. Is there anything here that I can look at? Yeah. Path isn't that way. What's this way? Okay. This way is broken. So I'm starting to think maybe I should not have brought Javik. We've almost lost Kalros. Get down from there and we'll find you. Because I have never encountered a man who is so much of a Debbie Downer. Are we gonna have it munch? Are we gonna have it munch? I wanna have it munch! Munch. Have the pressure mom munch it. We don't have a plan for this. Vengeance is the goal. Suicide is not. We're curing the genophage no matter what it takes. Everything my people will ever be depends on it. And I hope this idea you were talking about is a good one. It was hers, actually. Cal Ross. We summon her to the Reaper. Would that even work? Already discussed strategy. Just need to distract Reaper. Draw it from power while cure synthesized. Released. What makes you so sure she'll come? Legends say she is the mother from which all other Thresher Maws spawn. This is as much her home as ours. If Tuchanka has a temper, Cal Ross is it. <laughs> Nobody's ever faced her and survived. We flew through the Omega-4 relay and survived. We can do this. That's the spirit, Shepard. How would we summon her? The tower was built in an arena devoted to Kalros's glory. The Solarians thought she would scare away intruders. Appears to have worked. There are two Mahamas there, the largest in existence. If you can activate them, Kalros will come. That should distract the Reaper. Meanwhile, laboratory nearby. We'll finish synthesizing cure. Let's make sure we all get out of here alive. We're gonna have one hell of a story to tell. I'm so happy. Wait. I want you to know that no matter what happens, you've been a champion to the Krogan people, a friend of Clan Erdnot, and a sister to me. 
to every Krogan born after this day. The name Shepard will mean hero. Now, let's show them why. Go! I've got this! I have earned that Rex! And this is my planet! Good! I'll see you on the other side. Stay alive, Shepard. We'll have cure ready. Okay. I get to do the fun part. Let's get in there! <laughs> oh, it starts immediately! Sorry, Liara. But someone has to raise those maw hammers before you can use them. We're kind of busy, Rex. Lucky for you, I'm here. I'll handle it. Get your own planet. <laughs> yeah. This is the Krogan's planet, and they aren't going to give it up easily. Not that any of them gave up their planets easily. The Krogan's are just extremely. Uh, good. At last, the Reaper! I kind of want to take a pot shot at it. Yeah. Leap. Whoops! I'm down here now. I swear to God. Just get shot by a reaper? Consider that practice. It mad. Okay, Shepard. I raised the hammers. You have to activate both of them. My advice is avoid the giant laser. Thanks, Rex. I appreciate your... Wait, what? I had to figure out where I was going. <sighs> okay. Okay. Okay, Shepard. I raised the hammers. You have to activate both of them. My advice is avoid the giant laser. Are we sure about this? I remember this part. Just keep moving. A dead end. I can't believe we're actually doing this. this is That's not the way. Stick to cover. Commander, this is Artemis Queen. We'll try to give it a for something else to shoot. Go, just be with them. Go, let's push ahead. Okay, distracted it for a few seconds. Over on our left, one of the hammers. The second is on the right. Getting to them is another matter entirely. Oh, this? This is easy. This is fine. Oh god! Oh god! It is not fine! Okay. 
you haven't been hit yet. Okay, 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 okay. Oh my god. <gasps> Fuck it. Yeah, I know! Oh, good! Oh. <laughs> Working on it? I was expecting a stalemate. Not the, not the. Holy fuck! Morton, is the cure ready? Yes. Loaded for dispersal in two minutes. Procedure traumatic free, but not lethal. Malin's research invaluable. She's okay. Headed to safety now. Her survival fortunate. We'll stabilize new government should Rex get any ideas. Good match. Promising future for Krogan. Damn! Control room at top of Shroud Tower. Must take elevator up. You're going up there? Yes. Manual access required. Have to counteract STG sabotage. Ensure cure dispersed properly. Morton, this whole thing is coming apart. There's got to be another way. Remote bypass impossible. STG countermeasures in place. No time to adjust cure for temperature variance. No. No other option. Not coming back. Suggest you get clear. Explosion's likely to be problematic. Morton, no. Shepard, please. Need to do this. My project, my work, my cure. My responsibility. Would have liked to run tests on the seashells. I'm sorry. I'm not. Had to be me. Someone else might have gotten it wrong. range from Mervyn 
A long time ago, my father betrayed me in this place, his own son. He tried to kill me, so I had to kill him, right over there. That's what the Genophage reduced us to, animals. But you changed that today, Shepard. Now we'll fight for our children, not against them. It's just a pity Morden had to die. He wouldn't have had it any other way. But I'm sure wherever he is, he's putting in a good word for us. We'll name one of the kids yeah. after him. Maybe a girl. <laughs> but you, Commander, we can thank you in person. Tell the Turians I'll be deploying troops to Palavan immediately. And when you're ready to kick the Reapers off Earth, you let me know. The Krogan are back in business. Goodbye, Commander. What will you do now? Spread the hope you've given us. Even now, there are clans gathering in the Kelphic Valley. I'll go speak to them and make sure this gift isn't squandered. Thank you for all that you've done. And know that Erdnot Bakara calls you a friend. Explore a lost city. Amazing. Hell of a thing you just pulled off, Commander. Curing the Genophage? I never thought I'd see the day. Rex has agreed to help the Turians, Admiral. We should get their full support. I take it that leaves the Solarians out of the equation. The cost of their support was too high, sir. Well, I'll defer to your judgment on that, Commander. Let's hope we don't need them. Pack it out. Commander, Erdnot Rex has begun sending troops to Palavan. You kept your end of the bargain, and now I'll keep mine. The Turian hierarchy will stand with humanity against the Reapers. Is either the Krogan and the Turians or just the Solarians? Yeah, I think the Krogan and the Turian are a better option. Uh, the Solarians are... Well, there's something. I'm glad we can help each other out. It's the only way we're going to defeat the Reapers. That much is certain. To that end, several dry dock ships are ready to help build the Crucible. Garrus will coordinate them. Yes, sir. And when the time comes to deploy it, the full measure of our fleet will be there for Earth. Yeah. Which, I mean, they have their place. watch over us all. And they are important in a war like this. I'll start managing to but... support right away, Shepard. Must be exhausted. More than dying, it can't be easy. I'll sleep when I'm dead. We both know you need a clear head to win a war. There's no room for mistakes here. You yeah. should catch some shut eye. Besides, I know where you sleep. We'll wake you if anything comes up. If you insist. Oh, good. Time for another nightmare. Great. Time for another nightmare. <laughs> oh, good.
the things in the background? The trees? Or the chat the shadows? Inky, I guess. Ugh, that's disorienting. Uh. <laughs> he would probably be proud of you doing that and probably would say so himself. Someone else might have gotten it wrong. It's like they're trying to be people, but don't quite understand how people work. I lost track of where the kid went. I know that's where I have to go, I think. But I'm also a little distracted by all the whispers and what they're saying. Oh, come on. Oh, there he is. At the center. Now, see, the thing that really disturbs me is the fact that he doesn't sound like he's crying. It sounds like it's supposed to be crying, sort of, but not really. It sounds like laughter, almost. Right? It's open. Hello, Liara. Shepard, there's something you need to hear. All right. Is this a bad time? Thinking of some friends who weren't around thanks to this war. That's thanks to the Reapers, not you. Are you thinking about anyone in particular? Caden back on Vermeer. He died buying us time to defeat Sovereign. Seeing what we're up against now, he might think his sacrifice was in vain. You know Caden would never think that. Yeah. That's one more reason I miss him. Didn't you have something for me? The Solarian Counselor has an urgent matter. Let me guess. He called the comm room. The Council must be taking the Crucible seriously. I'll see you downstairs. There's a light blinking on my terminal. Commander, there is something we should discuss. 
if you are finished rewriting history. I made my decision, Counselor. There's not much anyone can do about it now. Yes. We're going to have billions more Krogan in the galaxy. It's a good thing you saved my life once, Shepard. Otherwise, well, I have concerns about humanity's representative, Counselor Rudina. My agents have discovered that he's using his authority to move vast sums of money. For what purpose? We're not sure. If Udina's dirty, it's best we get to the bottom of it fast. Agreed. Come to the Citadel. We will review the evidence and discuss this in private. Valorn out. You know, given that you have... You have threatened me. Why would I want to be anywhere in private with you? Jesus Christ, that's a good idea. <laughs> Priority, the Citadel. Yeah, yeah, that was my, that was my actual plan. I just wanted to. Yeah. Well, looks like I'm able to, like, do some planet scanning if I want to first, according to this guide, which I probably will, just to check. Um, but yeah, I'll do that before I go to the Citadel if I have to. Uh, Ugh. Ugh. Well, within a decade, got got some time. Uh, yeah, it's fine. May as well walk around the ship. Commander Shepard, something you need to talk about? Do you know how the other races are doing against the Reapers? Believe it or not, the Turians and Krogan actually seem to be getting along. Or not Rex has deployed troops, and they're giving the Reapers a moment of pause. The Solarians are still hanging on to Sirkesh, but the Reapers are starting to breathe down their necks, too. What about the Asari? They have to be feeling the heat. The Reapers are moving fast with the obvious intent of taking Thessia. Interestingly, the Reapers are leaving Parnak alone. It's the Yogg homeworld. Can't say that I blame them. Yogg have teeth. Well, if we lose this war, it might be them running the next cycle. It's easy to forget the Reapers don't destroy every species. Just the ones who can threaten them. Any word on the Volus and Elcor? The Turians and the Krogan sent forces to the Volus homeworld, Irum. It might not be enough, but at least they've got Reaper forces barbed down in a nasty ground war. As for Elcor, they're still in the fight, though our projections show the Reapers encroaching on their territory soon. What happened to the Batarians? Never stood a chance, hit by the Reapers straight out of the gate. And without any allies to call on, I think the Batarians are history. Have we heard anything from the Quarians or Geth? Something might be brewing near the Geth border. But our intel is sketchy. News is getting harder to come by as things get worse. What about the extra help we picked up along the way? The Krogan and Turians have obviously been a big help. Erdnot Rex running the show is a bonus for us. And that female Krogan you rescued is rallying more support from the other clans. I'm glad you disabled that mom and Tachunka. We could have lost a lot of Krogan support. As it is, we picked up some Turian troops. Good to hear. How about the Solarians? Interesting wrinkle. We've been getting back channel commitments from the strike teams within STG. They're promising to back us. Even after I cured the genophage? Our intel suggests there are cracks developing between the military and the politicians. Good. These STG guys know the score. They're not going to jeopardize the entire Solarium Union just because some Delatras didn't get her way. What about Arya's mercenaries? Arya Talok, there's someone I never thought we'd be in bed with. 
The blood pack is useful <laughs> and violent. Mostly Vorcha I hear. We'll put the Blue Suns to good use. Intel says Narner Vosk is bringing his men, and that they're gunning for a fight. The Eclipse are providing troops and mechs. When we find a Reaper soft spot, they'll help us hit it. Don't want to know how you got Arya's cooperation, but whatever you did, it was worth it. What about the Rachni? I wouldn't have believed it, but the Rachni are helping us build the Crucible. Thanks. I'm kidding. Turns out they have a knack for weapons of mass destruction. <laughs> In hindsight, I guess they'd know a thing or two about waging a galactic war. No problems with them then? Other than scaring the hell out of our engineers, no. Not a lot of small talk going on there. What's our state of readiness, Admiral? I won't lie, Shepard. We're bogged down. Things aren't looking good in most sectors. We need to increase the tempo and chalk up some wins, otherwise... This won't end well for the human race. Or any race. Nothing more, sir. Keep me posted. Hack it out. Mm. Ouch. Alright. So, let's check... this. Oh, we got some more Alliance going. Fifth Fleet. Improving power grids. Ah, improving morale. Hell yeah, let's improve morale. Got some. Ooh, Krogan has almost bumped up as far as the Alliance. Got Rex himself. Got. Damn. The Krogan plans. Plan Erg not. Oh wow. Some mercenaries. Got the Turian forces. Oh, the Marine Division. Seventh Fleet. Ah, yay. Engineering Corps. Yeah. Oh, look at that. I've almost hit the minimum. Soon. Soon. Not bad. Alright. That's that. Oh, hey. Rex and the general aren't here anymore. I mean, that makes sense. They're off doing what they need to be doing. See the bits of the Maw taking down the Reaper? Man, I wish I could have been there. I'm just glad the diplomats are off the ship. A Krogan and a Turian in the same room is a fight. I mean, it wasn't very fun to be there. Truth be told. Commander, Admiral Hackett has requested your help with a Cerberus fighter yeah, base. Yeah, they're going the off area. to work on Paladin. Okay, let's check on my fish. I know I've got the aquarium VI, but I'm still paranoid, and I love my fish, so I want to feed them myself. Also. My thingy is blinking, so... Oh, my god. Erg. I think you underestimate Erg not Rex and his new, um... Girlfriend. <laughs> Since they forgot how to hold a gun. I'm glad you respect me, Francis. Oh. Hi. Oh. 
Amazing. Oh. Yay. Okay, that's that. More acid acquired. Jews hope colonist. Alright. Let's go talk to Commander, Chief Engineer Adams would like to speak with you down in engineering. Okay. <sighs> are you gonna tell me that things are good now? Let's go talk to Joker first. Uh, what? Alright, my turn. What's the first order an Alliance commander gives at the start of combat? Uh, I give up. <laughs> Correct. <laughs> Alright, big guy. What do you call it when a Turia gets killed by a horrible spiky monster? Friendly fire. Come on, that one goes back to Shang-Chi. How you gotta respect the classics? How many humans does it take to activate a dormant mass relay? 602. 600 to vote on it, one to ask the Atari for technical help, and one to request a seat on the council afterwards. How do you know when a Turian's out of ammo? He switches to the stick up his ass as a backup weapon. Why does the Alliance hire pilots with brittle bone disease? You're shitting me! The Turian military has one about me? Oh, absolutely. I heard it myself from a private back on Palavin. All right, why does the Alliance hire pilots with brittle bone disease? So their Marines can beat someone in hand-to-hand -hand drills. <laughs> Damn, you need to tell James that one. Hey, what's the hardest part about treating a Turian who took a rocket to one side of his face? Figuring out which side took the rocket. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'd see the Krogan and the Turians team up. Even the Reapers have to be a little nervous about pissing them off. I'd say more than a little. I'm sorry about Morden. He was a good man. Yeah, he was always running those tests. And one time he tagged me in the middle of the night to ask how many livers humans had. And this bump on my elbow? He said it was just a mild bone deformation, but I'm pretty sure he stuck a probe in there. I'm glad it was just your elbow. I always thought he was crazy. Useful, but crazy. Then he gives up his own life. <laughs> to save the Krogan. Doesn't do much to disprove the crazy theory, huh? I'm a bonk you. <laughs> I guess not. But he was one of ours. So now that we got the Krogan and the Turians, what now? The Krogan help us turn the tide on Palavin. They can shoot at something useful for a change. Dig till we hit daylight, huh? Works for me. So how does it feel knowing Krogan will be singing songs about you until the end of time. I think it would be an honor. There's enough misery in this universe. It's nice to see something go right for a change. Can't say I've ever really witnessed history in the making like this. Well, except for Sovereign attacking the Citadel. And then there was the Collector base, but this one felt good. And let's hope Rex keeps running the show on Tachanka. Maybe we should hire a food taster for him. Imagine the carnage if some young, hot-headed Krogan took over. It could happen. I know. It's a chance we have to take. But I have to say, if it wasn't my own world that needed the help, I might have taken that Salarian deal. I could never bring myself to do that. No matter what I was offered. I admire your restraint, Shepard. It's nice when we can save the galaxy without destroying another race along the way. Let's hope our luck holds. I wonder where all the Krogan will live now. I've never seen what you'd call a house on Tachanka. Oh, hey, Eve isn't here. She has wandered off. As is her prerogative. Alright, so engineering wanted me, so let's go. Let's go talk to engineering. They gonna have another equipment request? Not sure what to think about that little mech dog roaming the ship. 
You mean Sophie? I think she's cute. What purpose does she serve? She's a dog. Optimized ESO capacitors. Need anything, Commander? How's Engineer Donnelly working out? The kid's got talent. Now if he could just learn to shut his damn mouth. Problems? I'm sorry, Commander. Donnelly is dedicated, knowledgeable, and thinks on his feet. I'm glad to have him on my team. Could use a lesson or two about respecting chain of command, but I've handled the likes of him before. No need for concern. How's Engineer Daniels working out? Her, I like. She's sharp and knows propulsion theory better than most physicists I've met. And she's easy to work with, too. Always said you had an eye for talent. Good job bringing her back to the Alliance. Does the new Normandy stack up to the old SR-1? <laughs> stack up. The SR-2 might be... The IES stealth system is significant. And that means? We should be able to... All in all, the Normandy is a marvel. I know we talked about that, so... Carry on, Adams. That's... Aye, aye, ma'am. That was all stuff I heard. Sometimes keeping the grid balanced is pure murder. My board is green. Okay. Hopefully. Conversation. Commander. You settling in, Javik? I believe some of the crew wishes to be my friend. That is not my purpose here. Also, I find I need to wash my hands. The residue of the ship is strong. How so? I have been exploring. There are traces of those who lived on the Normandy before. I detected a human female. Her genetic structure was unnatural, as if artificially created. Sounds like Miranda. And a drill. There was illness in him. Same. And a Krogan who lived in these quarters. He was undergoing a metamorphosis. His memories were confused, not responding to his mind. There was great confusion and turmoil. I still can't wrap my head around that. Reading information like you do. For my people, it was as natural as breathing. Evolution's an amazing force. Our scientists believed it was the only force in the galaxy that mattered. They called it the cosmic imperative. The strong flourished. The weak perished. The governments of your cycle seem concerned with ensuring the survival of all. <laughs> He'll enjoy headbutting you. Yeah, he would. Was this imperative just your scientists' opinion, or did they prove something we don't know? The universe had already proven it. They only had to look around. And saw what, exactly? Extinction is the rule of law in the cosmos. The natural order of things. The weakest species are doomed. It's the duty of the strong to protect the weak. Otherwise, we'd have anarchy. But those who had nothing to offer would be eliminated. So conflict should be a way of life. Evolution demands it. The strong grow stronger by dominating the weak. It is for the greater good of all. Though I do not think your Asari approves of my beliefs. Liara? I think she just had a different idea about what Protheans were like. We are all a product of our time. Had I been born in this cycle, perhaps I would be the noble scholar she wishes me to be. You think you'd like that? It's a whole different line of work. I wouldn't know. Living a life of constant war. Taking life in every battle. I see how it could be tough to see outside the box. It is the only box I have known. 
it shapes me. A stone is shaped by the one who carves it. The stone has no choice in the form it will take. You and I, Commander, war is our sculptor, and we are prisoners to its design. Maybe not much longer. We win this and we'll both be set free. And then what? What does the future hold for a single solitary Prothean? Genophage cure, huh? This beats the hell out of reporting on the Milgram City Council. I don't think I've heard of Milgram. Which planet is that again? Beckenstein. It's right next door to the Citadel. I'm a colony kid. We go to Tahiti. Oh, that's right, they can go back to where they were. Oh. I'm glad to see we have Gareth back. I wanted to help with his scars, but I think he actually likes them. I mean... Oh, hi, Edie. You're down here. What are you up to now? I am uploading data on the destroyed Reaper to the Turians. They are investigating possible Reaper structural weakness. Our data says Reaper capital ships such as Sovereign are of unique design. However, smaller Reaper destroyers bear similarities. That one was small? Relatively, yes. Ground attack ships are only 160 meters in height. Uh. Sovereign was approximately two kilometers. Well, keep talking to the Turians. There's a chink in the Reaper's armor. We all need to know it. I see. Hello, Shepard. So that's how they're excusing getting all of them to look the same. Because they're just ground forces. Sound waves? Dude! Who are you and why can I sometimes trigger a talk but never actually talk to you? Ah, someday. Someday I will talk to that man. Yeah, true. Any sign of life? The Reaper destroyed by the Thresher Maw appears to be completely inert, Doctor. We would need to send in teams to be sure. Out of the question. Tell the Krogan to stay away. <laughs> yeah, let's, let's, let's. Weapon damage. Weapon damage. Sure. Oh, unavailable. Hello again, Shepard. What have you been up to since we last saw each other? Since you helped me defeat the Shadow Broker, I started looking for defenses against the Reapers. The Protheans were the only ones with substantial information on them. The older civilizations barely okay. had records. I'm pretty I much knew the elusive gone. man was hunting for the same thing when our agents began crossing paths. I hope like you on Mars. Well. I thought I'd um, covered I'll my tracks, but he had surveillance there all along. What's been happening with you as the broker, Liara? It's been exciting. The old broker's ship, impressive, but it was never meant to be space-worthy, which meant the elusive man eventually tracked me down on Hagalaz. What happened? I knew he was coming. Ferron and I loaded as much of the ship's specialized hardware onto a shuttle as we could. We got away from Cerberus's ships after arranging an appropriate distraction. 
What kind of distraction? Sending the broker's ship exploding into a Cerberus cruiser. I don't think the elusive man expected me to give up my resources in such a spectacular fashion. Well, you brought your little helper with you? Its name is Glyph. It helped sort through all the data that led me to the Archive on Mars. It was a pleasure to be of assistance, Doctor. Glyph's interfaced with the data feeds. Its analytical software should come in handy. How much do you know about this Prothean artifact? Very little. We're fortunate enough data survived to piece together the blueprints. Decoding them will require as many specialists as we can find. It's that high tech? I'd have killed for a glimpse of it during graduate school. We'll talk later, Liara. Of course. Greetings, Commander. Ah. Oh yeah, Garrus is up on the bridge, so he wouldn't be down here. Uh, Calibrating weapons. Mm -hmm. I guess it's shuttle day and that's it. Stumpy little build. Wish you could have seen that gun on Tachanka firsthand. I cut the auditory emulators and watched that Cerberus cruiser gracefully and silently disintegrate. Beautiful. Sometimes I worry about you, man. <laughs> Sounds fine to me. Alright, so I'm gonna go back up to here. Turians have given us top-level access to their combat data. Their ships are already moving in to help the Alliance fleet. You actually secured a Krogan Turian alliance. It's one thing to hear about Commander Shepard. It's another to see her in action. Okay, yeah, I could see that. I'm, I'm kind of uh, a thing. <clears throat> I have eight points. Uh... Things are just gonna get starting to get harder, I'm sure. Oh, the other one looks really cool. <laughs> that reputation. Hmm, service database. Okay. Um, and save. Save. Yes, yes, we are. Okay. All right. I hope you all had a good evening watching me play that tonight. It was fun to play. I enjoyed playing it. Um, there will be more of that where it came from on Monday. Sunday! Sunday is Sunday. I don't know what I'm doing yet. But I will know at some point. Um. Alright. You know, I know we don't have a lot of people here, 
but I have a feeling Kittlefish will enjoy watching this. So, we're gonna go raid. We're gonna go raid Rosalind. Hopefully she's still going. Yeah, yeah, she's still going. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Thank you, Shuri. I hope you have a good evening. Or a sunny evening for you. I hope you have a good rest of your day. Um, yeah. I'll see you all soon. I hope everyone has a very restful time when they next sleep. And don't forget to look at the stars sometime soon.